Hello, hello. How's things, peeps? Hello, Wormyswood. Hello, C0. What could Fredo do in this world now? I don't know. That's a good question. I honestly... It's kind of annoying how I've got two worlds in, like, the exact... I literally just did Big Queen in both of them, and now I'm, like, in the same... Same stage of the game where I've just got nothing to do. Well, no. I don't know. I don't know what I should do. I have not done Dragonfly, actually. Pardon me, that's a good point. Hello, Bubbin. Uh, I mean... Oh. Yeah. Normally... Actually, what's this day on? Do 239. Two, yeah, it's basically the same day count. Um, I've got health bar on, yeah, yeah. I could do... Normally, I don't... I don't I don't know. Dragonfly isn't the most compelling boss to me. I don't think it's boss... It drops that amazing. Because I still prefer the fire pit over the... I mean, okay, the scaled furnace is nice for, like, cooking stuff and things, but, you know. It's not amazing, I don't know. But the thing is, I've got nothing else to do, so maybe I should. Hello, Wormiest. I don't want to do Shadow Pieces again, because I haven't marked the marble heads in this world, and I don't want to do that again. <laughs> so let's do something else, this stream. Dragonflight is an idea. I could do something more chill, like, um... Pearl Quests, or I could just do both. Work towards both. I don't know. I can do whatever, really. Uh, yeah, it's that stage of the game. Maybe kill Toad. I have never killed Toadstool before. I would have no idea how to go. Oh, I've, I know what its patterns are and stuff, but I don't know. <laughs> Equipment and stuff. I don't know. I just don't. Ooh, game's doing the jittery thing. Okay. Uh, did I just come back from doing big... I think so. Whoa! Ah, oh, no! Hey, this stupid bug. Oh, I just got... I just did my stone fruit farm. That was something I did. Um... Ah, oh, I hate this stupid bug. Okay, let's go into... it. Someone's going into caves and going out again fixes it. So let's, let's try that now. Pearl Quest, that sounds good. That is something I can do, yeah. Uh, I have to go and kill Cookie Cutters for the first one. The second one is just marble and something, which is pretty easy. And the third one I need Cactus Flowers for, which is uh, annoying, So, because that's a while away, but... I got bundling wraps now, so even if I... I should just get that done. At least... Oop. That's alright. Okay, I didn't realise that was out of date. I'm playing solo, so it doesn't matter if people can't join, but I if that's going to keep popping up every few minutes, then I'm gonna, I'll, reset, I'll update it. Sorry, I didn't realize it was that day. Oh, well. What's WTF is that bug? I don't know. Amnesia? It happens sometimes. Updates, that yeah, it's like an update thing. It's really annoying. Sometimes going in the caves fixes it. You can also just, like, reveal all that stuff again manually, but I don't want to do that. I don't want to walk everywhere and manually uncover stuff again. Oh, god, yeah, Tips Worms to appear, that's right. Is it just one? Oh, there's a lot. Let's just leave. Bye. I'm just gonna see if this fixes the, the bug, because I don't want to deal with that. Like at all, basically. Are those little fangs on Weber's forehead? Oh, from the vignette. I don't know. I was. I don't really see. Fangs. Uh. Ah. Maybe. He has like the six spider legs. Ow. Fuck. Go away. Oh yeah. Is it back? Yep. All good. Okay. Weird bug. Don't know why that happens, but it is good to know that I can fix it by going in the caves and um going out again. Now what do I do? <laughs> it's the question of the day. Pearl Quest sounds like mostly chill fun. I, yeah, there's a salt biome right there actually, so that'd be super easy. I do need to go and get my boat. I left it somewhere else. Because I was too lazy to like go all the way back around. Yeah, it's there. Because I was too lazy to go all the way back around. After I got the stone for I was like, yeah, I'm just going to come back home. 
Okay, I'm I'm gonna go and update Gem Core. Because it, it's early in the stream. Let's just do it now. Let's just get it over and done with, because that's gonna be pretty annoying. So yeah. Sorry about that. I don't know. I didn't yeah. Let's go. Well, while I'm gone, I can think about what to do. I think Pearl Quest is a good idea. Let's do that. You know, pretty... Actually, Dragonfly would be pretty fun. Because I could just get a bunch of... I could just go befriend all my warrior merms. And just beat the shit out of Dragonfly. You know what? Maybe I'll do that. I'll do Dragonfly. Oh, no, I've got to actually update the freaking mod first. That's what I can do from the screen. But I still have all my um worms, warrior worms at the Big Queen Farm. I can just befriend them, and oh, Dragonfly will get the shit beaten out of it. Like it'll be oh, I might I'll, I'll get a stun. I'll get the bonus scales from a stun. Totally. Oh, war warrior worms are so powerful. They're so much fun, and they have so much health as well. I'll barely have to bring any armor. So this this should be a really easy fight. I've started playing on. PC, but I had find it kind of hard to hit stuff. It it probably takes getting used to. Have you moved from console Pokemon Fox? So hello Gabriel, how's things? Yes, okay. Oh, weird. Okay, weird. I oh, this is, was downloaded the whole time. I've heard people say that um console's harder to kite in. I guess it was take getting used to. Although the targeting, apparently the targeting in console is actually good. Because in PC, you press Control F and your character just attacks whatever the hell they feel like. Some random bird nearby? Yeah, let's go for that. Jeez. And apparently the console is better, but... I, I, actually, it probably just depends on how used you are to the control scheme or whatever. Also... Did I already say hello to you, Gabriel? I don't know. Still drowning in shame. I cannot believe you died to Ailey. <laughs> Not really. I did, okay. <laughs> There's a lot of... Look, to be fair, you got to juggle a lot of equipment. you got to carry, like, two thermal stones. you got to... Um... You know, you got to have, like, heat protection. you got to put down an endo fire. you got to also have the goggles on as well. And armor. You know, you gotta, you got to juggle a lot of things. But, it's a shit boss. Why are you even killing a dude? Is the, why, what do you get? You get nothing out of it. Uh, you could argue that you lose stuff by killing it because you could use um you could get free rocks from the falling boulders. <laughs> That's a bit of a like cynical perspective, but it's true. I've got no use for the. I mean, it's a good insanity station, but I don't really care about nightmare. For fuck's sake, again! Uh, uh, is it Gemcore doing this? Probably. That's right. I was running in the caves again. And Try not to get stomped by death worms. Depth worms, not death worms. Kill alien to avenge Gabriel. I don't know if I'll even reach someone in this thing. I might. <laughs> I've like never fought it. I've barely fought Antlion though. Because there's no reason to, but yeah. Why were you killing Antlion? That's a good that's my that's my question. I might fight an enraged cloud. Good luck, dude. <laughs> Unless you're playing as Walter and using cheese, and that doesn't count. Not often I'm up to this at this hour, but I'm always glad to catch a stream. Awesome geometry. Don't stay up too late though. Your sleep's important, but stream. Ah, oh, yes, I see what you mean. Little fangs, swermiest. I. I don't think those are on his in-game art. Actually, wait. One, two, three, four. Five. I think he didn't have eight eyes either. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, no, yeah, he had eight. Never mind. Bye, bitch. I just use marble suit, football helmets, and a high bat for dragonfly and star, star core. Yeah, easy. No cheese, like a man. You do it. But look, I'm not gonna need. I'll take a. I probably don't even need a weapon. I could just get my bunnies to do it. Um, I'll just take. I'll do log suits. I'm just not even bother with the star core. I'm just gonna use the regular fire. It's gonna be a freaking cakewalk with warrior merms. That's the great thing about word. Now that I've got warrior merms set up, I can take on anything on the surface because they can't follow me. Actually, 
I don't think they can follow me into the caves. I doubt it. If they could, that'd be freaking great. Oh, that'd be such a cool way to ch clear ruins. Just come with, like, a gang of... Although it'd be hard as to... No, you have to make a second Merm King on the caves, which is stupid. Uh, yeah. Let's make a lot more of these. I need to go... That's actually full. I don't think that... I, I, I need to go and do some tree farming. I don't think Fredo can talk about not staying up too late. Okay. Okay, Bobbin. That is true. That is fair. My sleep schedule is like, why? But yeah. They aren't in game, yeah. Alright. Let's do some merm shit. Get some wood. Uh, actually, let's pick berries to print them with because I'd rather keep my honey for myself. Does it last long? I just wanted to kill Antlion because I spent my summer farming on the surface. Oh, oh, you annoyed by it or something. No. What are you doing? Yeah, that's right. Stupid creature. Hey, boys. Oh, the fish died. Rip. Oh, yeah, Merm King's also dead. That doesn't matter. I, I don't need him right now. I did bring a shovel. I didn't bring an axe. So, let's go and get an axe. This is also too many merms for just trees, but whatever. I don't want to have berries. It, it, look, am, am I going to run out of berries? No. I need to actually get an axe so I can tell them to start chopping. Yeah. That's right. It's a chicken. Looks like it does. They do look like a chicken when they're sitting on the thing. All right, let's go. Chop, boys, chop. Oh, the gang. Oh, for fuck's sake. That was instantaneous. I hate tree guards. Right, now you guys are going to attack the tree guard. They're not in sync, which is, which is annoying. Why are they angry at me? I wasn't the one who even cut the tree. There we go. <laughs> oh, they're funny. Right, I'll take on this one. You guys take on that one. Deal? I can't see its health, so... So please don't kill too many of my merms. I need them alive. They're my workers. I'm probably out damaging them. Should have merm got in the way? Bruh. Imagine. Rip. Yeah, I beat you. Losers. Actually, how's this guy going health-wise? Okay, they're doing a pretty good job, though. Let's give them a hand. I don't want any of them dying. And as I say that, one of them dies. Fantastic. That's right. Good teamwork. Now get back to chopping! Stupid- that was literally instant. Like, not even a second of has just- bang. Tree guard. Choppy, choppy, chop. That's right. I love tree guards, wish you got- you wish you got more tree guards? Gabriel! I, I want regular logs, not living logs. My god, two in a row- oh, they're killing all my work- I hate tree guards. I- there needs to be a way to turn them off, I hate them so much. It's supposed- they've literally killed half my workforce. And they're all like, crippled, and I have no dark sword. Ah, I just want wood, man! You know what? Fuck it, fuck them. Ignore them. Help me chop wood now. Oh, they're not gonna. They got. They got. They got their, their priorities straight. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake! I just want logs, man. Dude, these guys. I swear to God. <sighs> yes, I will. I probably chop. Uh, or do stone fruit. If all my merms weren't dead to tree guards, fucking hell. <laughs> Isn't it supposed to be a rare thing that happens? Not every bloody tree you chop down. Alright, whatever. I'll keep that to give to the kingeth. I don't need this shitty ass meat out here. Okay. Oh, wow. I did not... Oh, hey. I didn't realize I had the... Oh, I probably got more dark swords. No, I know I have more dark swords than these chests, actually. 
No, other one. You're kind of in the way of that chest, sir. Yeah, there we go. Ugh. Well, yeah, I guess you can turn them off in world gen, but... That doesn't really count. And I do want living logs, like... <laughs> turning them off altogether would be a bad idea. But there's just so many of them. At least, okay, they, if they, well, there's one thing they should do, they should make it so there's like a cooldown. So if you get tree guards, you can't get tree guards again for like X amount of days. Because you don't need that many living logs. Like, even if you're only using dark swords, <laughs> there's no, how, that's fucking 47 dark swords. I, I wonder how much like, raw damage that is. A lot, is the answer. Well, oh, I can wait for my, I'll wait for my merms to respawn. Oh, what, what, the, what a waste of time. Actually, there's still one more tree guard left. Oh, let's go and kill him. I mean, I guess I'll never run out of living logs at least, but still. <laughs> like, living logs are more common than regular logs, which is like... Yeah. Ooh, imagine like a crafting recipe to turn um, living logs into um, regular logs. That'd be kind of cool, actually. It's like, purge the evil out of them, and they just become normal logs. That'd be cool. Also, I am not going to turn up an opportunity to give this many fish to the dude, because who knows? Tentacle spots? It's possible. Plus, I get my shitty stat buffs. Eh! First one. Awesome. Okay, only one, but still, that's pretty good. I got technical spots, can't complain. Now, let's take care of this loser. He loves to waste my time. He has taken some damage, though. The Mermans did a okay job, I guess. They still died. Wasting my time. It's always tree guards, man. Alright. I'll just chop myself. If each merm has a 1% chance to spawn one, that means you have 6 merms plus a player. Seven. Isn't it per hit, though? I think it's a 1% chance or X% percent chance per, like, chop. Every hit on a tree has a chance to spawn them. And honestly, 1% per hit, that's pretty high. That's pretty high. Yeah, especially with six merms chopping all at once. Slam the desk from Amank. Bam! Angry about tree guards killing all my merms. My workforce. Mushroom planters. Oh. I don't need them, though. <laughs> Just living off the living logs and stuff. I mean, actually, blue mushrooms are pretty good for healing. Ooh, actually, you know what? That might not... Did that tree die as I was chopping it? Wow. It wouldn't be a bad idea to get, like, a blue mushroom plantation going and then put them all in, like, a bundling wrap. Mm. Who knows? Because, um... Perukis don't do anything for me. And are there really any good healing meaty... What am I even using for healing? I just use spider glands. I don't really have a reliable healing solution in this world. I thought it was 1.33 per tree that fall. I th isn't it per- I I'm pretty sure it's per chop. Otherwise you'd be getting tree guards every six trees. I just got one every, like, two trees, though. I think it's, um, per chop, though. I don't know if it's 1%. Uh, I honestly don't know for a fact, but yeah. Yeah, tree guards every six trees seems a bit ridiculous. I, it's, it feels like I get it at that time, but... Like, sometimes, but I don't, actually. Anyone else find it? They drop monster meat. I guess because they're a monster? I don't know. I 
I mean, where's the monster meat come from? Who knows? It's kind of weird. It's like an implication that they're always like they're the. Oh my God, hounds. Because right now I'm at one tree guard for twenty. Two tree guards for twenty. I got some to spawn just before that first wave. I got two in a row, literally. We've 53 Dark Souls, you have 360,000 damage. Yeah, there you go, it's a lot of damage. It's enough to kill Misery Toadstool, what, three times? That doesn't make it sound like a lot. Oh, wait, why did I not reset this crap? Oh yeah, I've got to fix up my Tooth Trap field in this world as well. Okay, it's still making quick work with them, but... Don't know why I didn't reset them, I must have been in a rush. For some reason. Don't actually know what I would have been in a rush for, but evidently I was. Later losers. Okay, let's clean up all this crap. Oh yeah. No, I think it was um, yeah, beggar came around this way, and I'm like, oh, I can't be bothered dealing with him. I mean, no, I he, he triggered a bunch of traps, I think, and I just, like, didn't have time to re reset, and that was probably why. It was Beggar. Being annoying. Oh, yeah, we already did, did Deer Clops this winter, so that's right. Don't worry about that. Surprising, that's only enough for three Misery kills. Misery's Toadstool just <laughs> has so much freaking health. <laughs> so dumb. But also, I don't, I don't have enough nightmare fuel for all those dark swords. No way in hell. That's the most expensive part, really. It actually requires like me doing something to get, really. I think I have more logs and nightmare fuel at this point, to be honest. No. What? Wait, do I really only have that much nightmare fuel? I actually do have more logs than nightmare fuel. There you go. That's saying something, isn't it? Alright. Let's finish off these two traps and then go and dig up the rest of those stumps. 265. That's a lot of fuel. Wow. Uh, do I play with disease on? Not intentionally. I do have it on this world, on in this world, but that's only because I forgot to turn it off. If I had a choice, I would have turned it off in a heartbeat, but I forgot. And I am paying the price, because disease sucks! Oh yes, let's pick all these, actually, before they, like, disintegrate. Hmm. Sound the real. That's okay. This is already a ton. This is this would be a ton anyway, so it's alright. Man, yeah, stone fruit, stone fruit are amazing. Misery is a war of attrition. It's basically whoever runs out of resources first. It doesn't sound like fun. What do you even get out of it, actually? I honestly don't know. I know you have to. You, the way you summon it is really weird. You have to drop a bloated canary next to the mushroom, which is like so strange. But what does it even give you? I tried practicing with Wilson and it took me 12 days with the Flingo. What the hell? Wow. How long is that in like real life time? I don't, I don't know if I want to know the answer to that question. It's a long damn time, that's for sure. Okay. Let's get chopping, I think. Why do we even have this? Ooh. Oh yeah, let's get these drying, jeez. I'll just cook the rest and eat it normally, because it'll be spoiled soon. Knapsack, oh, well... Really? There's no point, What even? what's even the point? Ma knapsack's just the worst pan flute. Like, literally. Why would you... 
so pointless, dude. Crap suck, yeah. You literally get a pen flute for free. For doing nothing at all. You just find one on the ground. And they're super cheap anyway. Well, fairly cheap. But you don't need more than one. Out, out of time. Toadstool is just pure tedium, yeah. It sounds like that. It's kind of a cool... I like the idea of it summoning mushrooms. It's kind of cool. But the fact that it just has so much goddamn health... It's just like, why? Yeah, Cooked Kelp isn't that great, but... It was going to spoil if I... Before that next step dried, so whatever. The crap sec. 500 gunpowder to kill Misery. Wow, I... That wouldn't even work, I don't think, because, um, they get, a uh, damage resistance from, or gunpowder resistance, right? Actually, I'm not sure if that's only for gunpowder detonated in the same stack or at the same time. So, if you put down multiple stacks and they're going to boom at the same time, does it resist that, or does it, is it only, like, I'm actually not sure. I don't really use gunpowder, so I don't know. Because it's a lot of setup, really. Okay. So we got logs for- we'll make log suits. Uh, what else do I need for Dragonfly? I need to make sure my king is nice and fed. Um... I'll go handbat, not dark sword, and then that's probably it. Really, I don't have much in the way of healing, but as long as I get to aggro on the merms and not me, I won't need any. It's kind of- it's dumb not to bring- oh, oh yeah, pre-crafted fire pit. Um... Oh, yeah. Shit, walls. Of course, I gotta set up the whole wall thing. Forgot about that. Okay, I'll do that first before I bother with merms or anything. That'll take a while. That's alright. That's a good... It's good. It's a time-consuming task to do. So, yeah. I should probably get Dragonfly done in my wall-to-world -world as well. Alright. This is more than enough wood, but that's good, because I need wood for other stuff. If I want to make more merm houses and all that kind of thing. You know, I kind of want to do fuel weaver with warrior merms now. That would be f so much fun, but I'm not sure if they follow you to the caves. I know for a fact I'll have to make a second merm king in the caves, which is just so dumb. But if they follow me into the caves, that'll save me a lot of time, actually, um... Oh, actually, no. The question is if is they can is if they can follow me to the atrium as well, because you have to jump through a tentacle to get there. Hole. I, I don't know if they can follow me through that. Actually, that's probably a, a better question because I could always just build more. I don't. I. I mean, I could build more houses in the atrium, but that's stupid. There's no like barely any room in there, so I don't know. But that would be fun. That would be the most amazing way to kill a few even just storm the castle with a million merms take a lot of setup but it'd be f it, look the thing is that is that merms are so reusable because like they take a crap ton of setup but the thing is also fuck these things go back quickly because i've got you know you know all the warrior merms the big queen i can just reuse them and it costs me like 20 honey it cost me like, it's like all 26 honey or however many huts i made it cost me like nothing and it's just a super they're super super reusable, reusable. Well, i guess more like 25 because i gotta feed the king and stuff but you know it's pretty much nothing. They all just grew as I harvested them as well. That's right. Okay. How many log suits should I make? I mustn't forget that I got one. Let's make four. This is probably overcompensating. But I just want to make sure. Sick. And logs we'll put in here. Or I had some actually, not many though. Ah, uh, yeah, stone is the next big thing. I gotta go and go. I'm gonna go and get more stone from the stone biome. Don't they teleport to you if you're far away? Oh, okay, okay. That's good because that means I won't have to make mem houses in the atrium, which wouldn't be very good. It'd be annoying as to do. Uh, oh yeah, I'll still have to. I'll have to still have to do like the disabling shield thing. Also, uh, yeah, I'm not gonna, I'm not, I'm not gonna be able to sit back and do nothing like P-Queen, but, um, 
I don't know how much. Of, I don't know. I don't know if they'll take care of his woven shadows. I don't. I don't think they will. I don't think they'll do a good job against the woven shadows at all. They probably won't even attack them. They'll just ignore them. So I'm gonna have. I'll still have to bring weather pains. Actually, will weather pains hurt the merms? I don't even know the answer to that question. I hope not. <laughs> that would suck. That would kind of put a stopper on everything if they did. I mean, I could just kill them myself. Ugh. I don't know. Alright. Stone, how much we got? Probably enough. Let's get refining, I guess. Wait. How do I have that prototype? I never I've never made that before. At least I don't think so. Weird, okay. Okay, let's prototype the thing. Um, where is the dragonfly desert? There. Okay, what do we got set up? What? Oh, it's like in the swamp too. It's a bit weird. Uh, let's do it across that way, I think. Nah, let's do it that way. Let's, let's stay like far... Yeah, that's good. because That gives us lots of space to back up onto that isn't the swamp. Because I don't want to have to clear out tentacles and stuff. That's dumb. I don't want to do that. Alright, let's... Let's go... To the place and do the thing. With nine play with six players, the shield is going to be activated real quick. Yeah, I don't think even Abigail attacks the Worm Shadows. Oh, really? <laughs> Hello, Keki Flowery. One word could be one field boy. Yeah, but you know, plus all the merms. Who knows? Bam! I'm angry that. I don't know. That I might have to damage my own merms to heal Wovenge. I actually don't I actually don't know if um Weather Pain has damages your followers. I followers I've honestly got no idea. I think I'm pretty sure it's pretty just hits everything, so it probably does. Which isn't good, because I need those guys alive. Let's go and get more like oh the freaking depth worms in the entrance are so annoying. Let's make a dark sword and take try and take care of them actually. Oh, I don't like that scary. It's like four of them. Uh, or I can just take them to Rogue Lobsters. Whichever comes first. But honestly, let's get rid of them now because they're wasting a lot of my time. And they're also really dangerous. Let's dispatch. Let's take care of them. Let's not be dumb. Let's not just shimmy past them every time and hope I don't get hit. Let's do the responsible thing and actually kill them. I think that's a good idea. Is one Dark Sword enough to kill them all? I don't know. Yeah, it will be. Okay. Yeah, let's do that now. It's a bit annoying because it's winter, but also I'll pre craft this. One Dark Sword. It, yeah, it should be fine. You can kill Deer Clops with, like, one Dark Sword, so. They have... Oh, I mean, they have 400... No, it should be fine. If it's not fine... Look, I would have killed at least, uh, at least one, so... It's better than having four right outside the entrance. Which is honestly pretty... Sc oh, wait. I should actually bring armor with me. Yeah. In case they do hit me. You know, just precaution... Also, honestly, I think blue mushroom planters would actually be a good idea. Like, being perfectly honest, because I, I don't really have a long... Well, I was using the blue mushrooms for the most part, but they're not really... like. I mean, they're pretty close to my base. They're just in that cave entrance, but they're not in my base. So, you know, I think that'd be a good idea. Okay, I can leave my rocks. I'm not going to need these just yet. Okay. Let's just bring one. That's enough. Ah, oh, why is my inventory all weird? Alright, let's go. Also, fun fact, the total damage of a glass cutter being used against a non 
Shadow enemy is the same total damage of a spear. Yeah, they're not. They're not. They break super fast. Against, oh, I'm going the wrong way. They break super fast against non nightmare things, like really quick. I didn't actually know it was the same as a spear. That's pretty interesting, but. Yeah, glass cutters are pretty nice for sh shadow creatures. I mean, honestly, the biggest downside is you have to actually you have to assemble the altar and then go to the lunar island every time you want to make them. That's that's the biggest part. There's no way to, to prototype them. Um. Yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake! That is bullshit. Oh yeah. How's I how's I meant to avoid that? Please explain. What the hell? They should give you invincibility when you switch between shards. F Imagine if I was Maxwell. Wouldn't that be... I would just be dead. Insta-dead. Oh, that one's stuck, which is good. I fucking hate Dems Worms, man. Oh, good. Actually, if they do that, that means I can... Because if I can only fight one time, they're cinch. Still a bit intimidating, but, you know, it's better than four. Uh, actually, two is fine as well. Oh, that one's Diagroed. Make it one, I think. What? No, get back here. Okay, I, oh, I examined the thermal stone. Do the wrong thing. Shit. What are they do? Oh, for fuck. I hate when mobs in this game do this. They just run back and forth for no reason. Depth of so much. Yeah, I saw that. Okay, three is fine. Ish. I'd rather I I'd rather have to fight zero to be honest, but you know, whatever. Why are you out of sync? What? Poopy. Please tell me she's attacking the same one. <laughs> so I can actually, like, finish them off. Tedious. Not really. Oh, yeah. Because when they're in sync, they're pretty... I thought I had... Oh, they're in my freaking backpack. What? Whoa. Spawn camp? That was a massive spawn camp. Dude, these guys are time wasters. Holy crap. One of them's gonna be close. No, 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 Oh, yeah, I've got campfires do that. Don't get caught in the rocks. Let's not let that happen. I want my insulator pack. And all the stuff inside it. So, god damn it, this one got out of sync. Frick. There we go. That's it. Coax them back together. There we go. It's a lot easier to keep two in sync, that's for sure. Oh. And it's infinitely easier to keep one in sync. Oh. You could have attacked them, like, not randomly work. You could have attacked the same one each time. So that they'd die, you know, not all at the same time, but whatever. Your call. Cool. I will keep these, actually. They're pretty nice. And I'll kill this one last, this last one here as well. Wait, that's just a mole. <laughs> that's, I thought that was a, that's literally just a mole worm. I thought it was a, a depth worm. Wrong worm. Okay, whatever. They're dealt with. Whatever. It's over. Uh, 
Uh, now what am I doing? Yep. Dragonfly wall. I was doing that to get rid of them, I think. Okay, all good. Play Pizza Tower is the best. Is the beast. Pepino is good. And bets in game, play game. P, comma, LS. What biome is usually good for mega basing? And um, do I remove wildfires in my worlds? Um... Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I guess my is right. I'd say Oasis if you have wildfires turned on. But look, if you're mega basing, just turn them off because it's just awful. And if you want to get like a. Oh, yeah, I didn't actually get light bulbs. That was the reason why I wanted to go to there originally. If you want to get like a mega, mega base, you're going to want to go into more than one biome. So. Or you just hang around in the caves every summer, but that, who wants to do that? So. Yeah, I'd rec. Yeah, I'd just turn it off. But if you were sticking to a one biome mega base, I guess Oasis. It's 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 a nice. I mean, it probably depends on the world. I, I, it depends on like um. Like the, the geography. Like if the, Oasis is just really tiny and ugly, then I wouldn't recommend. It. it just depends on the world. But Oasis, I mean, the Oasis biome has the Oasis in it, which is really nice. I think it's a nice, it's a nice looking feature, and also the cactus, cactus are kind of hard to incorporate because they appear randomly and you can't move them. But you know they could be incorporated into a nice build. So you know, I think it's a good biome anyway because it has some nice non relocatable stuff. Obviously, if it's relocatable, it doesn't matter because you can just move it. But yeah, it's very clean. That's right, not much to clear at all. Cactuses are probably the only real thing. To get in the way, really. Bones, are just you just hammer them. Yeah, it's pretty much just cactus because you gotta burn them, and that's kind of annoying. I just pick the place that gives me the least distance to immobile. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is true. It depends on the world, really. It's it's hard to just say. You that such and such location is better than such and such because, you know, if how much they can, their usefulness can vary depending on their location. Um, they don't need constant fertilization. Reddit is wrong. Unless they are saying, unless you imply that it's summer. In summer, they do. But just, if you're just in the desert, no. They, they do not at all. Um... Berries need to be fertilized after every few harvests, but not twigs and grass though, unless it's summer. Of course. Okay, let's get let's let's get the wall. Go on. Get actually probably this is enough rocks, but whatever. Okay. Don't need this. Honestly, I'm not even using this. Let's just not take it. Okay, let's go. Yeah, go through this way, of course. Alright, sick. Let's make the wall. Oh yeah, let's warm up first. Might as well do that when I'm actually at base. Sit down. Uh, oh yeah, coffee from Shipwreck does. Yeah, no, berry bushes do wither after every few harvests. But that's it. I'm pretty sure that's it. Coffee doesn't? I'm pretty sure it does. Not every harvest, but... You need to give it ash a lot, don't you? I don't even know. I haven't played Shipwreck in ages, but... You know. Ooh, let's get these. Actually, let's see if my merms are respawned. I kind of want to bash all the stone fruit. Yeah, also stone fruit as well. I need fertilizing every few harvests. Evidently. As evidenced by the fact that they currently need harvesting. Man, you got to be quick for these things. <laughs> you still get tons, even if you miss them. What? 
that grew back quickly. Wait, do I ha do I have to um? I'm not actually sure. Do I have to pick them when they're disintegrated to get them to grow again, or does it not matter? I'm actually not sure about this. So that one grew back super fast as well. It's kind of weird. But to be honest, I'm not happy to just use my rod on something. Probably get a chest to put it in because it's pretty ugly. Just sitting on the floor like that. Alright. Let's get our mermaid friends over here. I actually didn't know. Yeah, I didn't know they broke stone fruit until recently. And my god. Is that good to know? No. Still dead. That's alright, I'll do it later. Not like I really need to. I don't need to pick him there, reset eventually. Okay, 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 good. Good to know. Stingy lady. That is handy, you know, that'll save me some time. Because I wasn't sure, thank you for telling me. They remind you of the Dr. Seuss trees. Yeah, they actually kind of look like that, I reckon. Yeah. Like the, a bit like the marble trees. In the set piece. Why do I have a pre crafted flingo? A bit like marble trees in the set pieces, I think. Yeah, I agree. Bunny farms in Oasis Pog. I. As, are you asking that as a question? I mean, I, I'm using mine as a spider grinder, but that's it. I didn't. Honestly, didn't really need the bunny farm. I thought I'd be using it for like carrots and stuff, but like there's just so many other good sources of veggies anyway, so I just didn't use it. Oh well. It's alright. Not the end of the world. Bro, a multiplayer world would be pretty cool. Oh. Yeah, I know. I should probably do like a dedicated server kind of thing. That'd be fun, I think. When you're so afraid of fires, you have pre craft fling at all times. That's like next level preparedness for fires. But probably a bit overboard, because you just bring a nice stuff, but you know. <laughs> That's like next level. Okay, I can just use the lava pools to warm up, which is pretty cool. Oh god, the swamp is just a wasteland. <laughs> I think I've reached the point where it's cheap and easier, cheaper and easier to just make the turf myself. I mean, I still have to come to the swarm, so I might as well grab the free turf that's there, but still. Go away. I'm about to start freezing. Wait, yeah, never mind. Let's do this. Takes a while. Alright. Ow. Hey, lice. <laughs> Actually, I can just stand like at a certain distance. That's right. They do have a pretty big heat aura. Okay, so let's go along here, I think. That should be good. Anarchy server? Uh, I don't know. I kind of want to do something that's like a bit more structured. I don't know. I tried doing anarchy an anarchy kind of thing with Minecraft. That was fun. You know, it gets old after a while, to be honest. And plus, Stone Star doesn't have as much, like, stuff, different things for you to do in an anarchy type server. Like, it's, I think it's more limited in Minecraft in terms of anarchy kind of stuff. Also, I'm actually overheating. Lol. Also, I can just use glowberries. What am I even doing? It's easier than carrying around land all the time. No, Gabriel, don't say the N-word. You get my stream banned. Hey, I guess I'll be out of, out of the competition. Just kidding. Yeah, that's, all, that's right. All you can do is grief, really. Especially just note stuff. <laughs> yeah. Either, like, try to survive or just stop other people from trying to survive. And kill them. Great. Yeah, I don't know. I... I don't think it's... A, it, it'd be fun at the start, I think. But it'll probably get old pretty quickly. Especially... Or in Don't Starve, at least. 
or Kitty Meow Meow. Ali Kitty Meow Meow. Thank you for the follow. Fuck. I don't have a hammer. God damn it. I can make one though. <laughs> God's sake, let's not do that ever again. No. Hey. No, don't actually hammer that word. Yeah, I don't know. How long should this be? Is this enough for this side? No, because you'll spawn at that pool. And they'll walk around it. Anyway, it isn't like I'm going to run out of rocks. Because I've got stone fruit set up, so it doesn't even matter. Like, at all. So, whatevs. I'm going to have too many rocks. I'll probably... I'm not going to use stone fruit too much because of that. I'll just end up with way too many rocks to actually use on it, anything soon. When's the next YouTube video? Yes, the next video is the boss tournament. Uh, I'm working on it. I didn't work on it today because I was out of out of house doing stuff. But I'm ma I'm making pro. I'm I'm not like trying to power through. I probably should get like work on it a bit more. But you know, I'm getting there. That this should be fine. This is a bit sketchy, but it should be alright. I can still fit through there. Yeah, this should be alright because. If I'm in the middle here, yeah, that's fine. That's probably a bit too much, actually, but better safe than sorry, yeah? That was instant. Wow. Instantly caught on fire. But yeah, boss tier list. I've recorded most of the fights. I'm just going to start writing the rest of the script and editing it, really. And also record the rest of the fights, you know. Next video better be a poop speed run. Oh yeah, did you want me to actually do that, dude? I couldn't tell if you were just me. I mean, obviously it's like partially a meme. But like, do you want me to record the thing and then like just send one to you, like on Discord or something? The files or or whatever thing. I put a statue right next next to the sea right there. Oh, good idea. Uh, I had to either make a statue maker here or carry one over, but that's right. It's okay. They shouldn't be able to pass through there, I don't think. Fuck. I did it again. It's okay. So we get all the resources back, so it's right. Right. We good. Is that a large enough wall? If I stand here... Yep, I'd say it is. Yeah, I think it's good. Yes, please. Okay, sure, sure, sure. I'd rather see the pot. Look, I mean, the poop speedrun, I'm probably not going to actually put that on my channel publicly. I do... I hope that I have somewhat of a quality standard for stuff that gets put on the channel, not just some random, like uncut footage for however many minutes. You know, I don't like I don't like the idea of just uploading random shit. To be honest. Uh oh, the statue would be to block off uh larvae. They shouldn't they they should go towards me, I think. Actually I'm I i do not know because it's closer. I, I don't I actually don't know. Maybe a statue would help. Block it entirely and use a boat. Uh, okay. Maybe it's a good idea, actually. Magma in the winter looks gorgeous. Oh, yeah, look at those colors. It's nice. And it keeps me, not, it keeps me like, toasty warm all the time. This is only for light. Nothing else. It's annoying as in summer, but... It isn't summer, is it? So. Yeah, I think let's play... Let's, let's make a statue. Let's make a statue thing and... Get a boat kit as well. Hey. Hey, you as well. Through the barren wasteland. <laughs> it's so sad. There's just nothing left. Alright. 
Yeah, maybe I should just, like, not rely on that. I mean, um, maybe I should, maybe, maybe I should just make my own turf exclusively from now on. So the swamp doesn't just end up as a barren wasteland. There's just this, like, ugly, empty part of my world. Because it is kind of sad. Why would I run away from the middle of the pool, though? Well, for, I don't know for sure if they're gonna... They should just go towards me, but... Because it, it technically is closer to go the other way, so... I'm gonna play it safe, I think. Better safe than sorry. And I would... And as I kite Dragonfly, I'm gonna miss... Actually, I'm probably not even gonna kite Dragonfly, because my Merms will be taking most of the hits. But, still... I might slowly move one way or the other, so it's probably better to be safe than sorry. Imagine if the reed trap spawned near enough that you could bring Dragonfly in there. That could be good. You'd have to be very careful. or oh, it'd be super dangerous though, because if you enraged and you were like a second too late in the pen flute, bam, that's all the reeds gone. Honestly, I wouldn't eat that. I wouldn't say that's even worth worth the risk. I just use like Deerclops or Beggar or something else to take care of it. She always does the ground pound as soon as she enrages. So you could, you could block it with a pen flip, but you have to be, like, bang, right on time. That was a really bad click. That was also bad. My, my fin hands are really dry today. There we go. I don't know. I'm not very good at... My hands are super dry. You, you get the idea. Like, perfect time. No. Wait, wait, you can use him on the floor? I didn't even know that. I actually do not know that you can use him off the floor. Okay, the more you know, I guess. Uh, okay, let's make a statue maker. Two boards, I've already got two boards in this chest, I think. Three, as a matter of fact, but, you know. Uh, and I have the blueprint for the... Well, I can just make... What statue should I make, actually? Let's just do... I don't know, whatever. Hornocopia or something. I'm just going to bring... Uh, or I'll bring, I'll, be, I'll bring Moon Rocks. That's the, that's the coolest looking one. Moon Shards, I mean. And two rocks to make the thing with. And that's it, I think. Um, I'll also need a boat. So that's right. I've got tons of wood. Deerclops, yeah, Deerclops works. So does Beggar. Whatever, it doesn't really matter. If it works, it works, I guess. Yep, let's check my bull kelp. Oh, actually. No. Oh, also, have my merms respawned yet? Because I do want to actually mine these stone fruits so I can eat them. Because I'd rather save bull kelp for this sanity, to be honest. Oh, Deerclops statue. Alright, sure. Nope. Oh, it's spring now. I didn't realize we were that f far through winter. Wow, okay. Let's... Oh, there's more of them. God damn, these things grow back quickly. <laughs> They're so good. And you get three per harvest. Yeah, Deacob statue. Sure, why not? Is there a mod where you can see the whole map immediately? Try planning to get a good world for a long playthrough. Uh, there's a command you can put in to reveal the whole map, or you can use too many items. And there's an option on that mod to reveal the whole map, which is basically just putting the command for you. So yes, there is a way. Too many items. I think the old one's broken. There's like one called Too Many Items Reborn or something you're going to have to get. Those are all full stacks, but that's not. It's making a full stack. And then I'll fertilize them all. The plants, I mean. Not the stone fruit. I mean, no, yeah, the stone fruit, not, not the. Whatever. Not the, I, don't, I don't know what I'm saying. Come on, Merms, I, I need you to respawn. 
probably going to be my main food source, to be honest. Oh, actually, no, it's spring, so my, my bees are actually going to do work again, which is good, because that was my prior main source of uh, food. What else do I need? I've got the statue, boat, that's it, really. It's going to bring armor, handbats, and warrior merms. Let's go, we'll put down this stuff first before I do that, and then I'll come back and get my actual equipment done. I remember one winter, the Deerclops um, was about to spawn, but then spring came and cancelled it. Oh, that's annoying, actually. Well, I don't know. It depends if you wanted the eyeball or not, I guess. Uh, yeah, let's go to this stuff. Let's just do that now while I wait for my merms to respawn. Actually, it's how, how are the bees going? Also, let's actually plant these. Yeah, good idea, work. Oh, I should make a, like a, a marsh turf path up here as well. Because I come here pretty often. I should stream Pizza Tower for my, your birthday. Beppino. JK, JK, unless. Dude, when's your birthday? Tell me. Because that'll be a pretty good day too, I think. Yeah, Deerclops just can't appear in, in spring. After winter ends, Deerclops is not real, basically. And if... Well, no, if you keep him on screen, it'll stay, but that's about it. So you need to be careful. Uh, I'll just put these here, that's alright. I probably should actually push them all into the middle. I'll do it later... Later, I say. Why is this like different? I don't know. Let's put it there. If I can reach it, it's whatever. Oh, actually, yeah, how's this thing going? Oh, wow. It's a fair whack of loot. I'll pick it up later. <laughs> I just want to get dragged by down, to be honest. Just want to get the old Fly of Dragoon. Done. Start trying this stuff. Hello, Leazal the Procrastinator. August 10th, okay. What day is this day? 30 30th. No, it'd be 31st now, actually. Because it's past 12 a.m. <laughs> That's how time works. August 10th. Uh, shit, when does the Risk of Rain update come out? I I'll probably, yeah, I'll, yeah. You know what? Why not? The free build. Of Pizza Tower. Uh, okay, are we good to go? How, when will my, are my merms going to respawn? Come on. Also, yeah. Let's grab my umbrella, wherever that may be. Also, is there anything in here? Nope. There she blows. Shit, I'm just gonna leave my tan at home. I'm honestly not using it at the moment. I'm at full sanity, it's a bit of a waste. A bit of a waste of silk and stuff, let's just chuck it away. Ah, oh, yes, my babies. Alright, come and help me break stone fruit. And by that I mean do it all for me, please. Grab my pick. Yeah, there it is. Where are they? There they are. Help! <laughs> Don't eat them, you fat fuck, you bastards! Oh my god, I didn't know they ate them. Mine! What? You guys suck. I didn't think they'd eat them. I mean, it's bloody fast, but still. No, work. Don't mind. Pick. <laughs> the sound is so jarring. Hey, I got a sprouting one. 
I can see another one in there, actually. <laughs> no, 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 no! Oh my god, they're so fat. You freaking fat asses! Oh yeah, mine these actually as well. No, bad. Stop eating! Oh my god, they just all flew straight into that guy's mouth. Help! Oh wait, there's still a whole nother stack there, what the hell? <laughs> mine them! Mine them, what are you all doing? There we go. Oh my god, they're so freaking fat! Stop! Ah. Oh yeah, lens there, whoops. You know what, that's still a fuck load of food. <laughs> but I want it all! They ate every last fucking- oh my god. Actual fat asses. Okay, I think it'd be better to just have one merm to mine and me to pick it up. Wow, I got four sprouting fruits from all that? That's pretty lucky. It's only one in 100 chance. Oh my god. Well, still a profit in food overall. I <laughs> didn't realize that they would eat, eat that many of them, but also, I now have th this many rocks. <laughs> Hashtag Merm Squad. I mean, it would have taken four times as long. True, 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 true. It's kind of like where we. Yes, except I can't pick up pull this food before I can eat it, though, because they're so fast at eating it. Thank you, Nick Tree, for the follow. Oops. Okay, yeah. Let's just make sure my rocks. Let's just make a rock pile. What are you attacking this guy? What did Chester do to you? No. Come with me. Away from Chester. I need him alive. He's holding on my. Stop! That's alright, he's not gonna. Not even gonna die. He'll just be able to outheal that guy. Oh my god. They don't they don't they don't they don't really listen to me, do they? Freaking hate this stupid thing. Honestly. Does this mean I have to replant my bushes? I don't wanna do that. I'm tempted to just um let my berry bushes die out or something, because I don't really need them anymore. And just replace it all with stone fruit. <laughs> uh, which is my food now. They restore a lot of hunger, even just raw. Considering how easy they are to get. What about cooked? They'd spoil faster that way, though. How do I get all the leafy berry bushes? Ah, oh, um, from set pieces in the pig village, I think. I got them from. That's the only way to get them, really, I think. Oh, it's because the king is dead, yeah. Stone is ready again. I'm not even going to bother. <laughs> I don't need that much food. This is, like, way too much food for one person, really, so. This guy's persistent, and he's not going to, um, be the victor here, so. You know, whatever. It's on you, man. Oh, yeah, they give you way more than they're cooked. Okay, I'm starting to love these things now. Okay. Dragonfly. What do I need to do now? I need to... Oh, let's go and get some blue marchies, actually. For healing. Let's do that. Yep. Yeah. Oh, axe. That's important. And then I'll go and place the statue in the boat thing, and then... And then I'll have to go, and then I'll be good, I'll get my equipment, go and recruit my warrior merms, and then murderize them. Yeah, the, the leafy berry bushes are so cool looking. They're, they're pretty rare, you, you only really get them, they don't do anything different, but you only get them from, um, pig villages, I think that's, I think that's it. I don't think you get them in the world naturally at all. I think you could in adventure mode. It probably, probably, adventure mode had a lot of weird things like that, but, yeah. 
You should be able to change this game with a clean sweeper, yes. Same with like saplings and lunar saplings. I reckon that makes sense. Because, you know, it, it exists. Why not add more functionality to it, to be honest? So. Uh, wait, where am I going? I was meant to go and get blue mushrooms, but I just kept going for some reason. I forgot what I was doing. Oh, yeah, you only get those ones in Shipwreck too. That's right, there's no normal ones in Shipwrecked. I guess they look they look more tropical. Man, shipwreck was cool. I kind of miss shipwrecked. I could do shipwreck streams. That'd be kind of fun, actually. Also, bush hat skins when. Ah, uh, yeah, true. That'd be cool, actually. Yeah, yeah. I wish they they could just do the thing they do they've done with other skins, like you know, uh, with the straw hat skins, because normally stuff you craft from a straw hat also ha uses that same straw hat skin. But not the berry bush hat, because I don't know. It's not cool enough, I guess. Can you even make a bush hat with with the leafy bush? Nope, I don't think you can. Not with um, uh, juicy bushes either. <sighs> Bit sad, but it's not like you'll get more of them than normal. Actually, I don't know. Does that mean you just can't make them in shipwrecked at all? I never thought about that, actually. It is something I usually go out of my way to make. Because it's like... A bit of a gimmicky thing. But, you know. Right. I'm here for blue caps and blue caps alone. World hopping? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There is world hopping, but, you know. Just in shipwrecked. I guess not. Does the recipe even appear? First fight with you we've uh, done, get cheese and <laughs> how do you just go buzz? <laughs> nice. Ah, uh, the old cheese method. Oh damn it! Chop a tree. Yeah, like imagine fighting the boss and you can just cheese to death. Like really. <laughs> Still, I'm going for the storm the castle with a million merm strap in this world. So, I mean, it's I don't know. It's sort of cheesy, but. As cheese, you're just using a catapult to, or a pound to <laughs> grind it out. Alright. Choppy, choppy, chop. Okay, ten. That's 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 fine. Right. Let's oop, let's <laughs> not leave that behind for one. Okay. Now we go and build the statue, and then we go and do the thing. All right, dragonfly, you are going down. It's gonna get freaking stomped, dude. Yeah, might as well hire all of them, to be honest, as well. I mean, why not? It's literally at almost no cost to me. Because of how easy vegetables are to mass-produce. Would the merms work against Klaus as well, actually? I guess so. Um, Wait. Oh, they get frozen and, and set on fire, which would do damage and also stun like them. But... They're not affected by- I guess they'd be good against Klaus. Don't know why they wouldn't- I can't think of a reason why they wouldn't, really. I did miss Klaus, that's right. I can live. But next winter, that's on my to-do list. Try and kill Klaus with Merms. 
I reckon it'd work. I, I can't think of a good reason. Ooh, would they attack the deer? No, they shouldn't. Are you still doing this? My god. They shouldn't, because if I don't tell them to, and as long as the king is alive, they'll neutral everything, so they shouldn't. They shouldn't do that. But that is one thing that could very easily kill me. Oh yeah, we're gonna... Dragon flee, and just putting down this stuff. Ooh, wait, no. I'm missing two rocks. He'll give up eventually. I think. Actually, no, he won't. Let's just kill him. If it's still daytime and he hasn't gone to bed, then I don't think he'll ever give up. How was that, dude? What? And now he leaves? Alright, see ya. <laughs> Later, loser. <laughs> Alright. Klaus is lucky he doesn't always spawn in the same spot. Klaus' farms sound amazing. Yeah, he changes spawn locations. Actually, that makes him pretty cheese-proof, to be honest. Well, no, that... Well, to... To, against some cheese methods, or reusable cheese at least. Well, no. Some cheese methods. Because you can always just play Walter and just slingshot him to death. Wouldn't they cancel? Wouldn't they attack the deer since the deer attacked them? I don't know. I'm not sure actually. They might. I have to keep aggroing out the Klaus, but I. Yeah, 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 yeah. Death. Because Klaus is very weird with followers because the deer basically. So it'd be a good idea to make a test world and get the shot first. I, you know what, might as well do that at the end of the stream. Yep, I'll do that. If, if I don't forget, I will make a test world and test warrior moves against Klaus. Because that, that would be a really good thing to decimate him with. He would get stomped. If, I mean, I could take on him Rage Klaus. <laughs> with enough warrior moves, yeah. I mean, triple damage and health is like a bra, but yeah. Yep, I shall test it, Wormius Wood. I've seen someone block one of Klaus's small locations. Wait, I'm going right towards Dragonfly. To get him to. Sus oh, yeah, reasonable tree. Yeah, because you can actually block them off. It'll take you 50 years to find all of them, though, because I think he has like 51 different spawn locations or something. Oh, yo, Kanahan with the, um, VIP status. Hell yes. Okay, I'm just going to pull alt tab out of the game and give that to you. Nice work, my dude. Slash VIP. There we go. Nice job. Nice work. You have earned it. Wait. Ah, oh, can I not fit the boat there? This is a really unfortunate shape of land, actually. That's okay. I can always just go around a different way. Ugh, whatever, I'll just make the Hornacopia. Nah, Bubble Pipe's cool. I'd have to go and get a Dragonfly. Yeah, no, I won't bother with that. It's alright. Bit sad, but... Pog, awesome. Welcome to the Gamer Gang. No. Right. Yep. Sweet. Alright. That was kind of nice. It's kind of cool. Alright. Um, now all I have to do is... It's a shame I can't place the boat, though. Because it's in such an awkward spot. To be perfectly honest. So, that is a bit of a shame. Ugh, yeah. Because there's like a bunch of spot that I can't even place it down. Because it lands in such a weird formation. Oh. Actually, that might work. Oh, yeah. Not that it's really needed. It, I mean, I guess for emergencies, if I actually just... There's a land bridge across here anyway, so... I'd say that's not that handy. It's a pretty bad spot for... You know... Whatever. I had an extra boat thing. Might as well use it or something. I've got tons of wood anyway. Now I can do this. Slam the desk. Bang! I'm angry that... I don't know. There's not much to be mad about right now. That may change. Do I think farms deserve an improvement in quality of life update? Yes. Absolutely. They're very 
not good. <laughs> they're so slow and they're so expensive. As wall -E, they're good. Well, they're needed for a lot of recipes, but... That's about it, really. Like, honestly, it's... You get more hunger from, like, any other source. Especially because they've added stone fruit and bull kelp now, which is really good sources of everything. They really are very overshadowed. So, yeah. Just playing offline means you mean you can't use mods. I'm always having an issue. I think so. Yeah, I, or actually, I don't know. I don't know for a fact. Because I know mods are stored locally. They're stored on your computer. I mean, obviously they are. So I'm not, I'm actually not sure. Maybe, though. Yep. They don't work in winter. They take ages to grow, even the improved ones. Um, Well, Wormwood, Wormwood, yeah, obviously. But, like, that's um, different because it doesn't actually cost you... Whoa! I hound out of nowhere. It doesn't cost you anything to actually... Um, plant the seeds. Let's just do things the glowberry way. Okay. Get that walking cane boost. Get to my tooth trap field ASAP. For five farms, you need yeah, the freaking ten grass per farm is like so ridiculous. Isn't it like six rocks as well? I'm actually gonna check when I get back. It's a lot of stuff though. Meanwhile, berry bushes are basically free. You just shovel them up, stick them in the ground, one fertilizer, bang. And yeah, the the um basic farms are barely even worth making because they're like twice as slow, aren't they? I don't, I don't know, but I'm pretty sure they're like way slower. They're slower for sure, but I'm, I think they're like a ton slower though. So the improved ones are the way to go, but even then, because they're they're like immense cost. Whoa, is that it? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have to work on this stupid field as well. I'll do it later. I'll do it after Dragonfly. After I get that done. And both over oh, yeah, Wormwood just does that better. And because it's don't stuff together, chances are you can get people to play Wormwood and Wally. And then just not need to build farms at all. Okay. Wants to meet. Get out. Don't care. I'll push. Put this stuff away in chests. Uh, I don't actually know why I bundled up my seaweed, but whatever. For some reason, I like defaulted to. I did. I did that as Walter because I needed it fresh to restore sanity. But that's not. That's only a Walter thing. So that was just kind of an automatic thing that I did for some reason. Alright, now all that's left is to kill a bastard. So do we have... Oh. Yeah, let's um, keep these. Let's put my hand bat in there. When I make it. Uh, I have pigskin, yeah. Ooh, actually I probably don't have any. Let's go and kill a pig. I want a hand bat, not a dark sword. Hey, just one pig. Yeah, nice. Oh yeah, Beggar destroyed a couple of the houses, didn't he? Freaking Beggar, being a bastard. Oops. For fuck's sake. Hate pigs. You're dead. It's not what I want, though. Hey. Yeah. I got a smash. Damn it. Hey, it's you too. Oh, it's the whole gang. Please give me your skin. 
Wow, thanks for all this, thanks for all the pigskin. I'm loving it. Oh my god, just give me a goddamn pigskin. <laughs> at least they're kind enough to come one at a time and not all at once. Come the fuck off. I mean, I need meat anyway, but not this. Oh my god. Ah, I need pig skin. God damn it. Stupid pigs. Well, maybe I should just use dark swords. That feels like a freaking waste, but you know. Nah, I got, uh, nah, I don't want to use dark swords. Look, it'll be my merms doing most of the damage anyway. So, yeah, let's just use dark swords. I don't want to wait. <laughs> I'm impatient. I want to get this this fight done. I'm just bundle those in there. Okay. Don't need that. Don't need that or that. Let's just take what we need. I'll take that for heal for heals. Make a fresh dark sword. One dark sword sort of be enough. Because my mums will be doing the most damage, that's for sure. What, 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 what? Hello, online diamond. This game makes me sad sometimes playing yourself together alone. I guess so. It's still pretty fun by yourself, I'd say. There's still a lot to do. Don't kill the pigs. It's just re yeah, self defense, man. They, they attack me first. Definitely. Totally. That was a pig induced combat. Hello, XO. I'm looking how to install a fucking coax outlet into my room because my internet sucks and I need to do that if I want better internet. Oh, like, um, what's a coax outlet? I've never heard that term. Is it like a, a wall-to-wall -wall connector kind of thing? I don't even know what that is. Please elaborate. What the hell is a coax outlet? <laughs> I feel like I should know what that means. Okay. Should get on my log suits. Oh yeah, some fuel for the fire as well. We'll just take some, like, grass turf I don't care about. Sure. Can leave this. It's, it's, it's starting to warm up, I think. And... Uh, good stuff to prepare merms with. I think we're good to go. Oh yeah, king, 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 king. That's right, gotta feed the king. Mustn't forget. Oh yeah, let's see if my, um... Bees have done... They haven't made much honey. Maybe I should get more flowers. Oh wow, these are a bit too close together. I think. Let's get the let's get the honey that is there though. Might as well just enough for king, I guess. Okay. Oh, God, bunny, you dumb dumb. Yeah, I'll just I'll just use stone fruit to feed the king. That's right. Oh yeah, I'll cook these first actually, so they they give more hunger restoration. A good idea. It's a thing you connect a coax cable into. What's a coax cable? You mean an Ethernet cable? So it is like so like a wall-to-wall -wall connector. I think that's what that is. I'm not sure. I'm just guessing, but uh, you can make the half the fruit into seeds to maintain your fruit count for the next harvest, or you can turn every fruit into seeds very exponentially. Yeah, but that's a lot of maintenance for... I mean, I guess there's no limit to how many farms you can make, unlike berry bushes where there's only so many you can get in the world. But you don't need that many, even for a large amount of players. Let's move this. Actually, put that in the icebox. I already had a goddamn... Whatever. Alright, Mermus Kingus. Time to become biggest. Most of the time, killing Dragonfly with Pulse, she doesn't enrage. Oh, that reminds me. 
Pan flute. Don't forget it. <sighs> Don't eat that. I would have literally forgotten the pan flute and then, like, cried. Why is it... Why is the pan flute, like, the easiest thing to forget? It's, it's so obvious. You need the pan flute. But it's, like... It's, like, people forget it all the time. I forget it all the time. I, it's, it's not hard to remember to bring a pan flute, but... Coax is basically, even it's bigger, cooler brother. Okay. You connect the coax cable to the router, which is the... Oh, okay. I didn't actually... Interesting. I'm actually intrigued now. Like, is it faster than Ethernet, or does it have more bandwidth? Because I... Ethernet's twisted pair, which is pretty good speed. Well... I mean... Actually, I don't know if that affects its speed. I guess so. No, it wouldn't really. I'm, pr I'm assuming it's just more bandwidth. I'm not even sure. I don't know how this stuff works. <laughs> it takes more characters, though, all the farms to get... So if the farm gets buffed, you need more characters to handle it properly. But then you also need more food. Well, yeah. Look, I don't, food isn't, like, hard to get, though. Oh, he's done. Okay, good, 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 cool. Let's go and feed... The Mermiest Warriors. They come outside during daytime, yeah? I'm pretty sure they do. It's alright. By the time I get there, it'll be dusk, basically. Do I have the tree skin for the Shadow Manipulator? The tr the free skin, I think you mean. Yes, I do have that. I don't have it on this one, because I don't have a clean sweeper. Oh, I think I was actually going to make a clean sweeper. But I just, I just didn't get around to it, I guess. Oh, I'll do that later. But I think showing it off would be a pretty good idea. Thank you, Online Diamond, for the follow as well. And the only internet provider near where I'm at is Xfinity and CenturyLink, which, if I had to choose one, I'd much rather. Okay. Well, if it works, if it, if it works, it works, I guess. Internet can be a bit of a hassle. God, some ISPs are just so bad. Cough, Optus, cough. Imagine having a functioning customer help service. Optus be like, yeah, we'll put you on hold for three hours. Yeah. Freaking hell, such a shit ISP. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Muff, for the follow. Fredo, do I stream on Twitch? Yes, I do stream on Twitch, my dude. Every day at around an hour and 45 minutes before this time. Pretty much literally every day. Oh, yep, they're all good. Pro... Pro... Pro Mara Known. Thank you for the follow. Oh, they all have B-hats on still. That's okay. I don't think that'll matter. All right, gamers. We've got a Dragonfly to beat up. I'm going to recruit all these guys. I've got no reason not to. I mean, the more the merrier, the more she can get freaking decimated. <laughs> oh, this is going to be great. I mean, look, if they can kill Bee Queen that fast, they can, they'll kill Dragonfly even faster. Because there's no ads. Well, there are ads, I guess, but the, the ones that, the ads that do exist will get blocked by walls. So, I like they even matter. Wait, are there any that we're missing? Oh, there's one. Oh my god, the swarm of Merm Warriors is ridiculous. Right, that's all of them. Let's go. <laughs> so dumb. Yeah, I have no idea what I'm doing, but... Ooh, going this way. This way works as well. Oh, two hydrates. Okay, I'll, I'll do those now. Wow, I love your content. Oh, thank you, dude. And I play work. This is a dream. That's one. Mm. That's like the last of my water. I'm going to go and fill that up in a sec. That's right. I'll do that after Dragonfly. I want to get that done soon. Uh, Wirt isn't my... I don't really have a main, to be honest. I'm playing Wirt. I'm enjoying her a fair bit. This was going to be a throwaway world, but I started actually kind of liking the character, so it's still going. Beakweed got no chance. Oh, yeah, I've... 
B-Queen got killed. Oh, I'm not even going the right... Fuck. I'm not going the right way. B-Queen got killed in, like, less than a day. With all these... It was a freaking destruction. She got minced with all these warrior merms. Wasn't even fair. It was amazing to watch, though. How many are there? I think... 25... Maybe close to 30? I don't know. A lot, though. Gang gang, hashtag mem squad. Yeah, 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 I got this world, I got Walter World, uh, Uncomp Mod Worlds. I say that because I keep dying and making new ones. Oh, hey. And Oni, auction I include every four days as well. Cycle through them, basically. So one day of each, and then on to the next. I think I like that format. It keeps things fresh. Ice staffs are required for Crab King, yeah. You need them. Unless you want to bring, like, uh, at least 100 boat patches and spend more time repairing your boat than actually fighting the boss. Then, yeah, you need ice staffs. Or you can use, um, sling, like, flingomatic cheese. Well, I gotta go. Alright, see you around, dude. Hope you catch some more streams in the future. You can see you around. I'll be trying to watch your streams. Awesome. Anyway. Anyways, time for a short break with today's sponsor, Pringles Trademark. Actually, I think my mom's gonna get distracted on these guys. Just, just... Eyes on, eyes on the road, guys. Keep going. Once you pop, you just can't stop. With an explosion of wonderful flavors to choose from. My favorite Pringles flavor is limited edition... Pickle Rick flavor. What's your favorite Pringles? Oh god, kill me. Setting me up with sponsors. <laughs> you know, I like to think that there isn't a such thing as a Pickle Rick flavor Pringles, but don't go there, you freaking idiots! Okay, let's get this dude. Let's get the. Oh my god, they're so fucking dumb. Dragonfly! Oh, 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 I don't have my, um. Hey. Um, no, this way. F fucking stupid merms. No, this way. Come on. Okay, good. They're so fucking dumb. How many of you fucking losers are dead now? Three, four. Fuck, I did eight. Okay. That was six again. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. There we go. Nice. Why? Why? Why did you just fly away? Fucking hell. It's nice when this game just doesn't function. What the hell are they doing? What the actual fuck are they doing? What are they going? What are they doing? I'm just standing here in awe. What are they doing? Run away from the fire. Don't just walk back towards it. I fucking hate this game sometimes. Why did she- why did she fly away also? Why did the... Dragonfly fly away? For what reason? Why? Why do bosses just fly away for no goddamn reason? All the time- mid-combat, just... See ya. All that work you put into the fight- no, I don't care. Fuck! Why is that even- oh my god. I don't get why the... Boss flying thing is a mechanic at all, it's so dumb. What am I gonna do if they just- walk into the fire for no reason, then how am I going to get them to not walk into the fire? <laughs> oh my god. This game gives me the shit sometimes. Like, there weren't seeds on the ground they were trying to eat or something. They just kind of We're just walking at the fire for no reason. 
That's a good idea. I'll have to get walls and put it on the side. So they can't actually... They'll still get set on... F oh, I might need two layers of, of, of walls. Okay, I'll go and do that first. Wasting my time! I, I actually don't understand why they were just not, like, following me and attacking what I was attacking, because that's what they're meant to do when they're befriend- Like, I get they don't do that when they're panicking. But when they stop panicking, they just walk towards the fire again. And there were no seeds on the ground. They weren't trying to eat or anything. And they don't even try to do that when they're in combat. So I, I honestly don't even know. <sighs> okay. Yeah, something on the floor that they try to eat. That's 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 what I was thinking, but I didn't see anything there. Okay, I'll... I'll, I'll Make sure to get rid of any seeds or whatever that's on the floor. The fire damage made them freak out, making them get caught on fire again, which makes them freak out and turn into a vicious circle. But then they should they should have like not aggroed Wait. So I forgot to unwrap my mushrooms. They should have um like that one, one, one worm followed me. I think they don't path around walls very well. Obviously, yeah, the walls are meant to stop mobs from pathing around them. That's the whole. That's like the whole point to stop the larvae. So I can understand why they didn't go around the wall, but I don't know why they just kept walking. There must have been something on the ground. That's the, the only reasonable explanation. Maybe I should use marble suits. Actually, I can't be bothered doing that. I don't have any marble. If my there's no reason to use a marble suit. And a football helmet. If, um... Well, I would have a hand bat if pigs didn't drop five pieces of meat in a row, so... Yeah. Okay. And also, I'm not... The reason why I'm not preparing properly is because the idea is that the merms just do the whole fight for me. Because they can. I know they can. If they're not dumbasses and just walk into the fucking... Magma pool repeatedly. There must have been food. That's the only thing I can think of. too close. Just to preserve marbles to durability? I guess so. I don't want to have to go to the effort of making, of getting pigskin to do that though. Okay. Well. It, that, I didn't see any seeds there. Were they trying to touch this spiky bush perhaps? No. That's stupid. Let's make a blockade for them. It's just this wall. The other pond. I mean, just this pond. The other one's uh, too far away. Now, just, I'm actually need more. Just as a test, if I stand here, can I get it set on fire? No, okay, so the, it, this is now fireproof. If I stand here, they can, though, I think. So, oh, good thing I've got more walls, then. No, no, okay, cool. It's totally man-proof now. <laughs> that shouldn't happen ever again. Okay. Let's just do it again. You're right. Okay, I should be able to unwrap this as well this time. That's my healing. By the way, did you know Dragonfly takes so long to attack... So you can use a healing salve in between. I didn't know you could fit a whole healing salve animation in between. <laughs> That's good to know. They share, yeah, that, yeah, two armor pieces will share durability, but... Once you get a marble farm going, it's easier to renew than pigskin. And look, the plan here is just to get the merms to do it for me. Because I know they can take on Beakwing, they can take on Dragonfly. I meant, if they can take on Beakwing, they can take on Dragonfly. Beakwing does have more health. And a ton of ads that are actually, like, you can't cheese the shit out of, like, 
you can with um mag larvae so protection stacks in um uh single play look if this doesn't work if the merm strat doesn't work i'll just do it i'll just go and start a marble farm get marble suits and do it that way i just want to i just want to make the most of my you know like the two entire seasons i spent setting up the merm farm probably Larvae pathfinding works now, though, does it? Really? Because my merms were still pathfinding towards the thing for some dumb reason, so I don't know. They might have. I don't know. But even if they did, that's alright, because, um... My moments can just kill them. And they, they'll still burn out a lot before they actually reach around the wall. Ooh, actually, maybe their friendship time has run out and they're trying to go back home. That's a possibility as well. I don't know, though. That's the thing. No, I need that. <laughs> well, let's give it another shot. Oh, now that I blocked the pond. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. If you put walls there, it does put a statue in between. That should solve the problem. Wait, it. Wait, you mean it does? Or if I did put a statue in between. Would I need to do that as well? There is a statue on the other side. Uh, well, actually, I, I can make a pickaxe. Yeah, I can make a statue. I can fix that. Do I have a hammer? Can I make a hammer? Yes. To get rocks. That's right. Easy fix. Thanks for pointing that out. I wouldn't have realized that otherwise. Ignore. Eyes on the road, boys. Okay, let's get some rocks. Make a statue and pickaxe. I mean, not pickaxe. Oh yeah, got my merm gang, of course. That's actually enough. All right. Hey, I'm back for a bit. Welcome back, Muff. Yeah. Where's my? St I've still got my statue maker. Cool. Awesome. I've got all I need for a statue. I'm gonna have to haul it manually, which is cringe, but it's all right. Yeah. It must have been their time is running out. Except this guy for some reason. Oh, I, fed, I must have fed him twice. That's okay, I'll just go and get more food. That was why, I think. If I get the VIP status, no, VIP does not expire. It's forever. Uh, I think we have 30 slots now, actually. Wormiest. Because if, if you do, like, achievements on Twitch, you get more slots. Uh, slots. I don't like the Twitch achievement system. I think it's dumb to lock features behind... Stupid, arbitrary achievements, but whatever. It is what it is. But yeah, I have, um... Also, I don't have a pen flute, I just realised that. <laughs> so, that fight would not have gone well anyway. I just made a hammer, it's probably in my backpack. I 
supposed to. I thought like I was about to start taking food out of my backpack for a sec. <laughs> the way he just strolled over there. All right. Yep, pathfinding is still broken. Okay. Let's wrap up my mushrooms again. Let's go. Oh wait, I wish I got rope on the floor. Let's. Just to keep those mushies freshy. I'll keep that as well, actually. And that. Why not? Yep. Yep. Eh, it works. Well, why is he going this way now? Oh, he's trying to go back home. It was that. They ran out of time. That was it. That was the answer. It was There was no seeds on the ground. That's why. Okay. So I just got to get stuff that isn't about to go off. Okay. Good thing I've got bundle wraps. Nothing more just strolling back. Lazy! Yeah, because it's based on... Oh, these hounds are... So oh my god. Insta-dead. Or not. There we go. Hey. Oh! Uh, I might need a free Moose Goose kill, actually. I'm going to sit around and watch this, actually. Let's get a health bar to appear. Oh. Well, now she's stopped caring about that. Eh, whatever. <laughs> it's alright. I don't really care about moose goose too much. I'm not fast. Alright. Let's get some actually good food. I've got bundle wraps to put it in, so yeah. When you kill the shadow pieces, how do you find them again? Yeah, you get... They, um... You have to get them from, like, tumbleweeds and stuff. If you get the chest... Each chest... Oh. Not now. Uh, each chest trinket... There's, like, a chest trinket for each type of, you know, rook, um, bishop and knight. And you get them from tumbleweed and stuff, I think. And then you give those to the pig king and he gives you the sketches for it. I think that's how you get them. Oh yeah, dragonfly statue in the future? Good idea, to be honest. Frog grain's kind of annoying, but whatever. Uh, I guess I'll just use... Well, yeah, the spoiled stuff's gonna give you, like, no hunger, so... Bundle wraps are gonna be my friend. Yeah, because hunger... Oh, loyalty time is based on hunger points, isn't it? So... I'm actually going to need some good food. Some proper good grub for him, so. Bees, you're not working very fast. It's because it's I've been away from base so much, I think. Spider ground's going nice, I think. Okay. Food, 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 food. I could do more. St I could do stone fruit again. Nope. Let's do cooked berries. They give a lot of hunger. Oh, actually. Let's make more. Like a separate bundle wrap for this because I don't want to open that one. Actually, no. That's not. That's wasteful as. <laughs> one bundle wrap's fine. Yeah, once they're, when they're in statue form, like marble sculpture that appears naturally in the world. Like, uh... Where are, you, where are mine in this world? I don't even know. Like that. When they're like that, you gotta use a pickaxe. But then when you build the player, like the statue versions of them, you use a hammer. So yeah. It's a bit weird. Very organized base there. Is that sarcasm? Probably. It's pretty bad. It's pretty ugh. The marsh turf doesn't look that great, but the speed boost, man. Clay, marsh turf skins when? Come on, get on. <laughs> yep, yeah, I thought so. <laughs> hey, look, it does its job.
Frog Green's almost over. Yeah, Frog Green against Dragonfly wouldn't really work. I they can only just manage to kill a Moose Goose. So, yeah. Take the Mems on a chopping trick for chests and cobbles. Yeah, probably. I yeah, I need to keep on top of my tree farm a bit more. Also, why would you use cobblestones? They've got marsh turf. It looks nicer. True. But still. <laughs> okay, one stack of berries. That's good, I think. Okay, take two. We're gonna actually do it this time. We'll be good. We'll be smooth. Oh yeah, it's probably the second wave of frog rain, I guess, happening now, so... That seems to be the case. Usually it's like two separate little bits. Sweet, alright. Um... That's it. We can, we're good to go. Is... Ooh. Let's bring an extra Dark Sword. I don't know why, but I feel like I should do that. No. I need more logs to finish. I don't know, man. <sighs> Look, ideally, if the Merms actually do what they're meant to do, I'm not going to need... Like, I'll barely even need one log suit. But... You know, better safe than sorry, and all that. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, yeah. Let's feed up the king, actually, before we do anything else. Yeah, make sure he's nice and happy. Frog's just death staring me, yeah. Give me the cold eye. I did not know frogs didn't spawn in the ocean. Okay. Also, frog rain is like properly over now, which is nice. Because it's just gonna be annoying, really. Alright. Uh, let's go. Oh, feed. Mermus King is first. I'm yawning. Mermuth Kingeth, he's still alive, so. Okay, is it like, he's like at mid hunger or something? Rod. Bit peckish. This should be enough to get him to max, basically. Shortest frog rain ever. That was a really short frog rain. Muff. Not gonna argue with that. That was super quick. That was like a quarter of a day. That was really short, actually. Like, yeah. Normally, there's like a there's like a break in the middle, and like they start it starts happening again. But like, it keeps no normal normally raining. It's just, it's, it stops raining frogs for a bit, and then it starts again. Normally, that's what happens with me. But yeah, weird. But kind of nice in my situation because I don't have to bother with frogs to be honest. Let's go. It's dragonfly time. Imagine not getting frog grown for the entirety of spring. <laughs> yeah, true. It's nice to not have it. The it's it's really annoying. It's a nice way to kill moose goose. Because Moose Goose is jank AF. And they take care of her really easily, but still. <laughs> it's annoying. Magi plus walking cane on swamp with work is something that gives lets me sleep at night. Oh yeah. Crazy our speed boost, dude. I have a I do have a magic luminescence, I'm not really using it though. Don't know why. I, it it's sort of annoying to use because of the you know the whole chest slot thing. But yeah, I'm just using log suits because I it's too much effort to farm for big skin to be honest. Too much work. Why are all these seeds spoiled? Wait, where are they all? 
Oh, they're probably still walking. They, they probably got unloaded. Unless they all died to something, which is dumb, but it makes sense. Uh oh, where are my merms? They're kind of my like leverage. Where are they? Mermy boys. They're probably like just here. That's my guess. Hopefully they are. Oh yeah, yeah. Look at this freaking moose goose. I love how they attack at once and then just immediately give up. Like they're really not. What the hell is going on? This is dumb. Stupid freaking moose. Okay, let's start recruiting him. I don't need my land just yet. This moose goose is really annoying, actually. I hate it so much. Also, it's so weird how literally it, they give up instantly on like, attacking it. <laughs> like, they're just being stalked by this giant thing and they just don't care. And it makes it annoying to sort them out, actually. Which ones are following me and which ones aren't. They're gonna it's gonna kill some of them as well. Fucking bastard creature. Hate it. Dude. It's a piece of shit. Okay, we got a lot recruited, though. Three gamers here that aren't on my side. Come on. <sighs> Wait, why are these three like permanently locked in combat? Whatever. Just ignore them. They're dumb. They're immature. You guys are the, the real legends here. <laughs> Let's take care of this scaled fiend once and for all. The murmurs don't give a single fuck. Yeah. Until they started to. Actually, the good thing about this placement is now that I've blocked off the lava pool with water, I mean, water, walls, is that I can just befriend them again if they get, if they run out of friendship timer mid combat. Also, I should get rid of these hound nests, they're super annoying every time I walk through here. You okay, you help mum folk. Okay. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Stupid hound. <sighs> right, uh... Uh, let's eat this. Take my caps. Hey. Ow. Oh my god. Stupid freaking man. It's so dumb. This is not- is this gonna work? Is this too much hassle? Should I just, um... Because now it's never gonna get out of there. It's not gonna leave that area. And they're gonna be on fire forever. So... Yeah. I mean, actually, they're, doing, like, they're not doing alright damage. So, if I get to aggro on me and come over this way, then that's good. Oop. Oop. Is it aggro on me now? Yes. No. Dumbass creature, what the hell is it doing? Well, now it's a problem. Oh my god, they're so dumb. Why can't I just tell them to sit and stay? Now they're gonna have to. F <sighs> Stupid lava. You okay? Come on! <laughs> yep. They're all dying because they're freaking. Stupid. Hey, I don't know if you figured this out yet, but fire is hot and it hurts you. I know, wild. Don't stand near it, dipshits. I'm surprised they haven't been taken out by Darwinism yet. They're so f fucking dumb. Oh, yep. She's on me. Alright, let's get back on the other side of the wall. Or she'll just immediately degro. Okay, great. Fantastic. Not like I wanted to win this fight or anything. Oh my god.
Ow. They're all on fire. Every single one of them. What even happened there? They burnt my fucking backpack? Are you shitting on my fucking neck? They're all dead. They are all fucking dead. Every last goddamn merm. Except that loser, but whatever. Not the fucking... Dude, what, what is your problem? Okay. Now what are these guys doing? Um, uh, going home. In theory. Well, let's grab... This. I kind of want this. <laughs> Stupid heads. Oh, actually. You guys can help me. Hey, two's better than none. Please, Diagro. One, two. Oh, you sneaky bitch. I didn't bring the goddamn pan flute. How did I forget that? Ah, uh, for fuck's sake. Uh, and now it's flying away. Why is it even flying away? I don't get what the flying away mechanic. Why is... Actually, why is it flying away? What? <sighs> this game sometimes, man. Like, why is that actually a mechanic that exists? Why do bosses just leave for no reason? Okay, well, that sort of worked. Should have put walls all around the, around all the pools. I'm gonna have to, yeah. Oh my god, look at this machine go. <laughs> yeah, rollback moment. Oops. I'm gonna have to put walls around all the the pools. Uh, it's this is too much hassle. I should have just started farming marble and then made marble suits. <laughs> that would have been easier than it was Merp because they're so dumb. Really should have just um yeah. It's I'm gonna have to put walls on all the pools. And I forgot the pen flute again somehow. <laughs> and I was like just talking about it. Yeah, I think it's because like my brain writes it off. Oh, it's like it's super obvious. Oh. Wait, when was it? Why'd she fly away then, by the way? Why? I don't get why bosses fly away. There was no reason for her to fly away just then. For fuck's sake, go away. Fuck you, I've got admin powers. <laughs> when you roll back or enter the world, they Diego. Oh, weird, okay. That is strange. <laughs> Mem's had enough. Maybe he's a dart. Ooh, that might be a good idea. Well, or some sort of ranged weapon, because then she won't, um,. Well, the merms won't be on the other side. And that was, like, the the big... Actually, if I can reach her with a dart or any ranged weapon from the other side... From the other side of the walls, I won't have to put walls around. All the pools. Be easier. Where am I now? I... Don't know... 
Oh, I think this is a good spot to be at, actually. Yeah. Wait, then where are my merms? I had a bunch of merms at this point. Do they just vanish into thin air, I guess? Okay. Sure. Merms, not real. Just kill Bee Queen again. Yeah, I kind of want to do this now, though. I feel like I've committed myself to do this. And it's like, it's I've already done Bee Queen. And Bee Queen's just like, she dies in like a few minutes and that's it, so... Oh yeah, also, uh, let's not leave my backpack anywhere near it. Let's just leave it like a million miles away. <laughs> so that doesn't happen. That is weird why it doesn't, yeah, I guess they just don't remember followers in the rollback, in like the save files then. Just pick up the pies. Hydrate from Playtronics. Okay, I may have just gone fill up my water bottle. So that's alright. So slow. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that on the map. Yeah, I might have to go and do that. Ooh, yeah, I made a hamlet in my backpack. That's right. It's like a despawns a player. I think that is not stored in the save file, which honestly is understandable because you know there's a lot of data to store because there's a lot usually a lot of followers. So no, not don't have that, you dummy, you dumb head. Okay, no. <laughs> There you go. Yep, path is broken. Okay. Oh, let's test now. Can I even see her from here? No, I'm not gonna be able to hit. I'm gonna have to put walls around all the things. Range whip is too far away. If if that if I was close though, that would work and it would be brilliant. But yeah, that's okay. Not like I'm about to run out of stone or anything. Let's get this done before summer. Because I'm not doing this in summer. It's going to be 10 times... Oh! Weird. I hope they all don't do that thing where they don't make it back unless they supervise in the whole way, like... Is uh, they're all going to die. Okay, let's just go and get, go and make, go and get more rocks and finish off the wall. I should start playing League of Legends. You reckon? Uh, any reason why? I've had, I've heard a lot of people say that it's like, not fun. <laughs> I've actually heard a lot of people say it's flat, flat out, not a fun game. So, I don't know. Not that I've ever played it, but you know. Oh yeah, frog brain time, by the way. Actually, you know what, while I'm here, let's get the evil flowers to make a clean sweeper. Might as well do that. How many is it? I can't remember. Let's just get them all. Because if there's extra, I can just make it into Nightmare Fuel, I guess. Okay, it's, I, think, I think it's just six, but... You know, might be able to get Nightmare Fuel as well. Oh! God. Oh, that's enough. You perfectly fit the personality of the community. Oh. <laughs> Is that a roast? Are you, like, big time roasting me? Uh-oh. I just fell into a trap there, I think. Oh, 
going to the melee streams. Six, okay, okay. One off getting, oh, that's alright, whatever. It's free run, I suppose. Not like I need any more of that, but whatever. Yeah, Frog Rain doesn't work on Dragonfly. It would not It would not kill her. I mean, it'd help, technically, but it's way too much hassle. Because <laughs> then I have to kill her myself manually at the end, which, you know, I kind of want to do with the memes. No, I need some of those. It's, it's only one living log, I think, so that's alright. Unless it's not. I don't know. Nice. Last three. Wow, okay. Well, let's not try to get this one lost and stolen by a... Um, lure plant. Yeah, let's use a new skin. Sweet. I can do that. What about... Shit. What else, what else should I sweep? I think I just... I wanted to show off the new skin, but that was about it, I, th I think, though. Ah, oh, Tamashanta. That's what, that's it. There we go. That's the stuff. All right. Uh, I'll just make turn these to rot, I guess. Okay. Awesome. Let's keep that in the chest so I don't lose it ever. The community of LOL is super toxic and complains about every little thing. That's why I stopped playing. It's fun to see them from afar, though. <laughs> I mean. Is that me? Probably. It's just when the, the game does weird shit though, you know. Like... <laughs> I don't know, it's fun to yell at things sometimes. Okay. Stone. Make some more walls. It definitely would have been easier by this point to just get marble and do it, but... Look, I kind of want to just see the utter merm decimation, so. How many, how many walls am I going to need exactly for each thing? Let's try and visualize this, so I know how many walls to actually make. Uh, let's just make a lot. I'm not going to run out of stone. If I have extra walls, so what? Plus, I wanted to do every single lava pool, just like, just like, um... Those four. Those two don't matter, so yeah. Four lava pools. Let's say 20 walls per? That seems excessive. I don't actually, I don't actually know. Steve John, thank you for the follow. Look, honestly, it's probably any game that's competitive will have a toxic community, to be honest, because, you know... That's just how it is, I guess. One stack, actually, yeah. Let's just do one stack of walls per pool. That seems alright, I think. If it's too many, whatever. If it's too few, god damn it. Actually, that doesn't that doesn't even matter because this rock's literally in that biome. I'll be able to get the rest. No swear. This is probably going to be too many, but whatever. Got extras. I'll take him. <laughs> okay, let's go. Slam the desk. Bang! I'm angry. At everything that just happened. <laughs> My merms being total brainlet. When's multiplayer stream? I don't know, I know I should do one at some point, but it's like, oop, take that off. Ah, it's like effort to organize though. That means doing something. I'm just kidding. I probably should, I should get like a dedicated server to be honest. That way, you know, people can play on it like, you know, whenever. And then like occasionally I'll just do streams where I just, you know, chill in it and do stuff with people and whatnot. You know. That kind of thing. That'd be a good idea, I think. Get to it a bit. 
Pan flute. Mustn't forget that. I'm not doing the fight now. I'm just building walls, but must not forget pan flute. I'm gonna like brand that onto my forehead. I wouldn't really see that on my forehead if it was on my forehead, <laughs> but brand it onto my. I don't know. I'll get a sticky note on my on Windows to appear above the game that says that. How are they still? I hate how the game unloads them whenever they're not like on screen, and it takes them years to walk back to their house. It's really annoying. Okay. Oh no, that one. That one's too far away to matter. This one does. Let's hope I can do all this without triggering uh, L Dragonfly at all. Why would you go that way? You can't even reach it from that side. You Dumbass. Nope. Thankfully this is just outside of aggro range, I think so, we're all good. Hey, actually this way, she'll- they won't even- the- this way I can just fight her in the middle as well, because the, um... Oh, wow, 20 is like the perfect amount, actually. Because the, what's it, the... How am I still too hot, what the hell? The, um, larvae will just get stuck inside the thing, which is pretty good. I must bring the pan flute. 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 I mustn't forget. It's ingrained into my skull now. Surely. I shall. Whoops. I shall not forget. Also, 20 is the perfect amount of walls for that. So, guess I'm a gamer. Wait, is this actually. They can still catch on fire from that side. This is all fine. It's just that side. Oh my god. That shouldn't matter though. No, yeah. Let's better safe than sorry. This is way too much effort for a dragonfly fight. God. Oh my god. This heat damage is annoying as. How am I not cooling down? What the hell? God. Mm. It's a pain. Correct. What? That is indeed a... Oh my god. This is a nightmare. Also, I, I see Dragonfly just there. And it's a bit freaky. Uh, am I going to have to put a statue there as well? Potentially. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. That's all right. Um. Oh yeah, I just ate this ice. I didn't. Yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> Wise thinking. Yeah, I'm gonna have to make another statue. This is a monumental amount of effort for one stupid <laughs> dragonfly fight. Jeez, I might not get it done tonight. I don't know. Hey, at least it's reusable. I don't know. This is probably more trouble than what it's worth. This is definitely more trouble than what it's worth. Whatever, it's fine. Okay, we got two done.
there's one right underneath her. That's. Uh, I can't. I can't wall that one up. You know what? Fuck merms. I'm not doing this shit. This is a massive waste of time. I'm just gonna go and get marble. This is fucking stupid. <laughs> Cause I can't put walls around that one. It isn't even gonna work. It's just a giant waste of time. It was a waste of time from the start, but now I've cracked. Fuck this. Just gonna do it the old-fashioned way. They're probably not even- the merms wouldn't even have reached their houses by now. I doubt, I don't think. Yep. I would have had to like supervise them for them to walk to their houses like all the way back. Go away, dude. Later. Just gonna do it myself. <laughs> Frick these guys. Could I have made a little part of the wall that further forward so you could hit her from far away? Uh probably. I'm honestly not even gonna bother with memes. Ooh, yeah. Mar where actually is the marble at? Let's sort out my inventory first. Get rid of all this shit. Fun fact: Maxwell miners don't change the appearance of the glacier when mining it. Oh, really? The hell? Oh, it's it just like, it behaves like a normal rock and just mines all at once. That is weird, actually. Why aren't I using the epic and cool salt rock land skin? I don't know. I don't like it that much, man. I can't tell if you're being sarcastic. And uh, also, I paid like actual money for this land. <laughs> So, you bet your, you bet your backside I'm going to use it. And, um, I don't know, I don't really like the salt lamp, because it doesn't look like a lantern. It looks like a thermal stone. And the effect that it has with, like, the square dots of light looks really strange. I don't know, I don't really like it that much. I mean, if you drop it on the ground and use it then, then it's like, then it's okay. Then I kind of like it. But as a handheld lantern, it just looks strange. Walls. Uh, I should probably go and get more mushrooms in a bit. Um, what else we got? What else needs doing? Handbat. Oh yeah, marble, marble, marble. Okay, where where actually is my um marble like thing? live off these for a bit, yeah. There we go. This is way easier than doing it with freaking merms. I hate merms. <laughs> I don't know, I love them, but not for dragonfly. Um where's like a hot spot for marble? Did I even get any clockwork set pieces on the surface? Like at all? Is that a thing that I got? Also I'm probably not gonna face off against Dragonfly this stream. Um, because there won't be enough marble in the world to actually make suits. There's actually a chunk of world that I haven't explored. Let's finish, let's explore the rest of this bit and get the marble from there. Yeah, let's ditch all these log suits. Yeah, let's go. But Mr. Fredo Films, the Salt Rock Lantern is so cool and epic, and it looks like a Salt Rock, and the Salt Rocks are so cool, and everybody likes Salt Rocks. I actually, I really kind of, I want to get like a Salt Lamp in real life. I think they, they look really cool. They're a very nice ornament. Very pretty to look at. But not as a handheld thing, I don't know, it just doesn't click. Oh yeah, the Tesla coil also like shows you the nightmare phase really easily in the ruins as well, which is pretty handy. That's not why I use it, but it's a nice little side bonus. Because if you remember what the color cubes look like, then um, you can tell what phase it is anyway without the lens. But it does help a lot actually because of how violently purple it is. 
I am not going the fastest way. Wait, actually. This world is so yucky. This is slower though, definitely. And just like in the Walter stream, we're waiting for an epic fight in the next stream. Yeah, true. I mean, with Walter World, it's literally the next stream. I'm going to be doing Shadow Pieces instantly. But with this one... Uh, I don't know. Because I still want to I wanna get an actual like backlog of marbles so I don't run out just out of this one fight. But yeah. Why am I carrying this? I don't know. That was five people for Dragonfly fight, but... I swear I just heard hounds, but I didn't. I think I'm just going crazy. <laughs> I swear I just heard the hound bark sound, but I, I literally just thought I did, but I did not. There are no hounds coming. I, I don't know. Don't know what that was about. Doesn't the salt line do that as well? I don't think it does. It's because it's because I'm um, purple. Anything that's purple becomes red. Reddish when, in, when it's nightmare phase. It's like a shader color cube thing, I think, so. And this is like the most purple thing in existence. It's like, it's purple light, basically, so. I've been told it works, but I don't know for sure. Maybe it does. Is it purple? I don't know. Unless, I mean, maybe the, the color cube affects other colors than purple. I'm honestly not sure. Don't know for sure. Be worth testing, I guess. Hey, Lightbringer, welcome back. These losers are still walking back. What's the health of this thing? They've done nothing to it as well, lol. Another thing for testing at the end of the stream. Oh, yeah, what was I going to test? What was the other thing I was going to test? I forgot about that. I forgot what that was. Please remind me. Was it... It was something to do with Dragonfly, I think. I've actually forgotten. Wow. I'm not sure. <laughs> Oops. What do you mean? Oh, that's right. Klaus. Yeah. Well, at least with Klaus... Yeah, it's just if they d attack the... Um, deer or not. Because because with Dragonfly, uh, I mean, they'll get set on fire and they'll get frozen. Well, I don't know, actually. I'm Because Klaus will usually send those attacks after me, I think. So if I can just get him away from the merms. Yeah, he'll, he'll get a couple of them, but at least there's not magma pools everywhere, like in the Dragonfly fight. So only, uh, there's occasionally going to be a fire attack. Unless he gets... Unless they kill the deer, which is possible. I mean, merms... It turns more orange. Oh, okay, maybe. I mean, oh, you you didn't have you didn't have internet for three weeks, especially that's that's like an accomplishment, like especially in um uh Corona season. What would you even do? I would be bored out of my mind without internet. Oh, uh, I guess I could do model painting, but. There's only so much of that I can that you can do before you run out of models to paint. That would be hell. I am proud of you, my dude. Some games are true offline games. That's a good point. Slime Rancher, I Isaac Gungeon, nice. Yeah, those are games you can play a lot of, I reckon. I already have a big axe. Don't make another one. Okay, 10 marble. That's enough for two suits. I. Nah, I'm gonna make marble seeds. It's smarter to multiply. Also, I'm gonna finish ex exploring the world. Might as well. Oh! Would you look at that? More marble. And some gears, too. Hey. Goodbye.
I still have to do Lilith unlocks. I've barely got Lilith. Oh, I've actually got a few. I kind of... Lilith's mechanic is really weird, but it's pretty fun. You can get some insane builds. I mean, Box of Friends is really... Usually what I do is I just go for, like, battery items in the shop. So you can... Um, like, if you get the... Oh, I forget what all the, the items are called. But you get the one that allows you to store two charges. And then you can use Box of Friends twice. And then get triple damage in a boss fight. She's fun. Fun as hell. Like, it's weird. But it's technically... You get, like, a bunch of double damage stored. So, you know... Battery items, are, battery items are the shit, because Lilith's use item is super good. I had a green one recently when I had the D20. All the shops proceed to not have a battery in them. Oh, rip. That's a freaking rip, dude. Oh yeah, D20 on um greed can really easily be a game break counter, because you can just re-roll all the coins you get. And get infinite batteries. Which is then infinite re-rolls. Yeah, it can be mega broken, I think. Can, but it isn't like a guaranteed game break. Like everyone's, like the old blank card Yera. I'm glad they made Marble cheaper to make. Yeah, Marble Suit. It's actually like pretty reliable. And, then, and with Marble Beans as well, it's pretty reliable. Also, there's a. I didn't think there'd be another little biome here. There's nothing of significance in here, really, but might as well finish off the exploration. I wonder what we'll get quality of life in Steam and um next update, yeah. Oh, being able to switch to the old main menus would be cool. I kinda like those. It's a good idea, C Zero. It get two Steam oh yeah, that's just oh god, two Steam sales and green bones just a win basically. Just buy everything from the shop. Wait, yeah. No, yeah, it is, because that you you get free shop refresh. So yeah, you just win. If there's one thing I despise about greed mode, it's that the um, greed machine can jam. Like, if you break the game, if you endure all greed mode's bullshit, you break the game, you get 99 coins, you deserve to put every one of those coins in the greed machine. And I've had times where it's, like, jammed within the first three coins I put in, and I'm just, like, they're, like, well, why the fuck did I even bother? Last 20 minutes, like, last hour of my life doing this, in, like, game mode, <laughs> wasted. <laughs> Basically. Hello, Ver Victoria. I never get Diplopia Steam Diplopia Steam sale combo. Uh, yeah. Bit of luck, I guess. Okay, that it was only that. Well, let's head back. I got enough marble. I could do it now. Oh god. Stream's supposed to end in ten minutes. Yeah, I'm not gonna do <laughs> Dragonfly's stream. But I know what I'm doing next work stream. I will at least get my marble. Hey! Wait, yeah, I got Merms to chop my marble farm for me, so maintaining it is a lot less tedious than as other characters, that's for sure. Blank card, two of diamonds in the first floor! Oh my god. That's not a game break, but it's like really good. Greed mode is fun, I do like it, but it's so RNG based, you just gotta get good items, otherwise you're dead. End of story. Bye bye. And don't even get me started on greed. Yeah, that shit is just like the same, but on steroids. You need a broken run to win, basically. And the fact there's so much good stuff locked behind it as well is like, like if you want to have fun playing the Lost, you gotta do greed mode to unlock Holy Mantle. And there's an entire character lock behind it as well. There's a fair few items as well, isn't there? Kind of like Delirium? Yeah. I feel like it's hard. I'd say greedy, Ultra Greedy is harder than Delirium. From my experience. I'm not a pro or anything, but you know, like... I haven't actually I haven't actually beaten Ultra Greedy. I've come really close, though, on an Isaac Greedy mode run. But then they made it so Greedy... Has to be unlocked, and I haven't unlocked it yet, so I can't actually attempt it again. But I th <sighs> there are more opportunities to get good items in um not greedy in normal mode, though I think. Like you can pretty safely guarantee you get devil deals and stuff. 
But with all, I mean, you can do that in green rose. I don't know. I, 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 I feel like it's delirium is easier. I'm, I'm not sure. I'm probably biased because I've been delirium more. I don't know anything about the dragonfly flight. That's a lie. I know some things. <laughs> I actually didn't know you could unjam the machine if you're on teleport. That's good to know. But then again, if. It's a big if. Had potential, but yeah. Oh, yuck. But yeah, mega RNG fest. I mean, look, Isaac is a pretty RNG dependent game anyway, if you want to have good runs, but still. It's just like RNG, the, the game mode, basically. They probably could have empath empath emphasized on the greedy on the greed part of it more as well, because like uh, all there is really is like a uh, like you you can hurt yourself to stop enemy spawning, but that's it. That's the only thing to do with greed explicitly. And you gotta, I mean, you gotta make that decision. Am I gonna take half a hard damage from this button, or are the enemies gonna do more than that to me? So you, you gotta figure out if it's worth it to press the button or not. But still, that's like one pretty sm like reasonably small thing. I don't know. I feel like they could have. That's a pretty small gripe because it's also just like not fun to play a lot a lot of the time. So, all right. Don't need to be coming this round. Let's make some marble beans. Yeah, we'll put these away. Where do I even keep my gears? I honestly don't even know. Wait, do I have any gears? What? They're yeah, probably one of these chests. No, I have n zero gears, you're telling me. Oh. Alright. Sure, they can go in there. Weird, alright. Let's make some marble beans. Isn't it a full hard damage? Oh, maybe, I don't know. I don't usually press the button. Because the thing is, if you can't keep, if you can't do enough damage to take out all the enemies in the room, you might as well restart. <laughs> because you're not going to be greed, that's for sure. Ah, oh, after first floor, okay, that makes sense. And Shaka, thank you for the follow. Have I already cleared ruins in this playthrough? Yes, I have. Oh, 14 gears in the purple gem. Oh, yes, okay. Did I, just, I just missed them, didn't I? <sighs> Why are they... Okay, I'm going to move there. That's a dumb spot to put them. Because that's like... That's gems. Gears are not a gem. I don't know why that's in there either. But yes, I have done the ruins. That explains why I have that many gems. <laughs> I think there is a little area that I hadn't cleared out, but I can't be bothered going back and doing that. Okay. Let's get this show on the road. Get these things planted. Alright. Oh, back my eyebrow on. Oh, I step on it by accident. <laughs> the character you unlock is shit. Yeah, I know. Creeper. Creeper. Keeper isn't that good. But he looks kind of fun to, like, infuriating to play. But I, I like his gimmick. You know, it seems like a... I mean, he, he, you need to beat Isaac for him to be good, though, really. Because then you get the wooden penny. But I don't know. It's a new character, right? I just want to unlock him. Also, I still haven't unlocked the Forgotten. But fuck that, dude. Being attacked by the Mumfoot all the time. And I'm not I'm not very good at Azazel at all. Because I know Azazel's meant to be like the overpowered character, but I, I like the, the the short range on his laser beam attack is like I'm really not good with short range. I always run into enemies and die quickly, so I th I should get better at Azazel before I attempt to unlock Mums. I mean, um, the Forgotten. The Forgotten looks like so much fun though. Do I prefer Thulcite Crown or Suit? Definitely Crown, because of you know the whole backpack thing. Hello, Exotic Bunny. So hello, reset until you get bomb immunity. That's yeah, that's a good idea to be honest. Get 
pyro or um, skull thing. I mean, if you get pyro, you've just won because the mum stomps will heal you. But um, host hat would help as well. Also, I love host hat so much. <laughs> Such a fun item. It's, I mean, the the damage that it does is like negligible. It's just fun. It's just fun to have an item which like shoots stuff. It's just fun, and it it is also really good. Oh no, it's also a chance to negate damage as well. So a bit of infamy in there as well. It's just fun. It's just a good all round item. It's cute, yeah. Okay. These are some outdated memes, my god. Alright. Now what am I doing? <laughs> Haven't got to that step yet. Uh, oh, let's replant all my bushes. Disease is coming up soon. I'm so much to do that. Oh, no, actually. Two trap field. After this hand wave, i got to get to work on that. Yeah, this is pretty dead. Fredo, I need caffeine. Help. Get some coffee there, man. Oh, I don't know what time of day it is for you. Maybe it's too late for coffee. Uh, don't be afraid to caffeinate. I don't know. Maybe that isn't good advice. Because, um... You know, it's a very addictive substance, but... Yeah, this two threat field is very outdated. As in, it's like, mostly dead, so... Actually about half dead. I just woke up at noon. No Man's Sky. No Man's Sky, so my life went, yes! Someone else who enjoys No Man's Sky. Fuck, yes. Oh, dude, the, um, abandoned freighter update, so cool. So much fun. And you can actually, like, upgrade your freighter now. And, like, do cool stuff with it. It's hard to find people who like No Man's Sky, to be honest. Such a fun game. It's a very addicting game. You can... I know what you mean, though. You can lose so many hours in it super easily. So much fun. Uh... Yeah. There's so much to do. It's so good. Add me, Frodo. <laughs> I mean, sure. Why not? I don't know. Uh, yeah, let's just drop all this stuff. Oh, God. Let's just drop all this stuff right here. I'm just... I'm just gonna remake it all together. Oh, Rip King, I guess. He sucked. I started a new run last week because so many updates came out since I last played. Oh, how long have you owned the game for? I only got it, like, fairly recently. I think it was on sale. Oh, just after the EXO, just after they added the um, mech update, that's when I started playing it. So, fairly recently. I think it, it probably went on sale. I can't remember exactly why, but probably a sale, something like that. But yeah, it's actually a really good game. I've lost a uh, probably concerning amount of hours in it. <laughs> uh, to be honest. I've had it since early, early. Oh, one of the OGs. I mean, it must be pretty... Because, I mean, I mean, I I wasn't one of them, but it's improved a lot since they first, you know. Gonna go take a nap. I'm too sleepy. Alright. Good night, Cakey Flowery. Enjoy your nap. One, well, actually, I might, it might not be night time for you, but... Happy time of day. Enjoy your nap. It's well deserved. I played it since it was early access release, and the resource was just giant floating rocks in the sky. Well, some of them still are, but yeah. That does sound pretty early. And I was alone in a vast universe. Oh yeah, because it didn't have like proper multiplayer, did it? Well, it did, but like you had to just randomly encounter players. Ooh, let's go and get some more logs, actually. Yeah, Merm Gang, where you at? Please, no more tree guards. Also, yep, I have hit three hours. I'm gonna go for a bit longer, I think. Uh... Yeah, we'll just use this shit. 
all of them were like giant balloons. Oh, weird. I mean, it, what the hell is going on then? Yeah, I still think asteroid mining is a bit weird. You just kind of shoot asteroids and then gold and silver just like teleports into your inventory. I think you should be able to land on asteroids and actually mine like ore deposits. That would be, because that was like one thing that I was like, wait, that's actually how you get gold and silver? I was like, what? Well, that's so weird. <laughs> oh my fucking god. Get away from my base. Away, 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 away. Okay. <laughs> Stupid idiots. It's just a gaggle of idiots. Uh, chopping implement. Do I not have one? Guess not. Just knock up a new one then. Oh, wait, no, I've probably got one in one of these chests somewhere. Yeah, there we go. Do I stream daily? Asks and Shaka. Yes, every single day. Three hours. I know three hours isn't the longest stream, but it's just I can only really stream late at night. Just during, oh, fuck's sake, literally instantly. I knew it would happen. Because <sighs> during the day I've got um I'm busy. I've got stuff on. Oh, there's three of them as well. Fantastic. And my my internet's also worse during the day, and I don't want to go to bed too late. But yeah, every single day. About three hours before now. I hate tree guards. God. Hey, at least this baby one's easy to take care of. No, not my troopy. Get him alive, man. Oh god, that was close. That was too close. And you're dead. Fuck you. Freaking man blocks me. <laughs> Dipshit. Okay, let's go and heal up. Long enough for me? Well, that's good. Yeah, I would go. Plus, my stream stamina isn't amazing. I do get, like, tired pretty quickly and stuff. Uh, yeah, let's wrap the rest of this stuff back up. Freaking hell. Two tree guard spawns, like, instantly, both times. <laughs> I don't want living logs. I just want normal logs, and they're all fucking dead. I just wanted logs, man. Just wanted logs. Is that is that too much to ask? Jeez. <laughs> Let's kill him with this thing. I can't bother going back to my base. Wait, they're attacking the tree card. <laughs> Thanks. Appreciate it. <laughs> Whenever I need living logs, I'll go to Fredo. Can I be selling? I could. I could sell them. <laughs> After this, uncomp and then Oni. Um. Yes, that's correct. After Vert. Oh, back to Wormwood World tomorrow. I'm. Excited and nervous for that. I've literally got more living logs than I have regular logs. Oh yeah, what was I actually doing? Oh. Tooth traps, that's right. Okay, I'll get the tooth trap field done, and then I will test Klaus versus Warrior Merms, and then I'll end the stream for tonight. There should be an item that disables- yeah, like just some like, like sacrifice something to disable tree guards or something, because it's so annoying. This is enough. Wait, is it? Yeah. I, I don't. Wanna, I don't want to to just turn them off in the server settings because I don't like messing with server settings too much. 
except disease, because frick disease, but normally, like, you know, I like to keep things pretty vanilla. But, um, you know, and that doesn't change the fact that they are just really and really annoying to deal with late game, so, yeah. Yeah, like some sort of shrine to, you can sacrifice, like, I don't know, something to, um, to the, the like, forest gods to appease them or something for a short while. Just five days. Just one day. Even. Just one minute. No, not one minute. You know. I know what we'd sacrifice, though. Sacrificing logs would make sense. Pine cones. That'd make sense, actually. Ooh. Because you get a ton of extra pine cones anyway. Really. And it makes sense, because it's like... A sign of new life, not like wood, because that shows you just destroyed trees. You know, pine cones. Or, actually, better, instead of adding like a shrine kind of thing, what they could do is make it so planting pine cones will reduce the chance for tree chances for tree guards to appear. Because I know you can plant pine cones to appease them when they or already exist, but like if you plant pine cones, it'll just like. Like, for every pine cone, it'll reduce the chance for them to appear by a small amount. Because, you know, you're appeasing the forest gods. Before they're like, frick you, he's a tree guard. You know, kind of thing. Okay, two traps. I should have left these pine cones. I th sorry, I've got a pile of pine cones here. Just need 60 logs. 60 teeth, 60 logs. Now it's just rope. No, I'll dry these all first. <laughs> they should truly hire us. TBH though, for reals. Yeah, they should. Alright. Let's get crafty. I'm probably going to have enough grass to make 60. But, you know. I'll make as many as I can. I've got grass in my grass farms. Oops. <laughs> Five bucks an hour plus a skin. <laughs> I don't think it's... I think it's illegal to pay workers in virtual goods, but, you know. Sure. Look, if no one finds out, it's not illegal. If... Yeah. If no one finds out, are you really breaking the law? So. I'll just, I'll just make as many two traps as I can. See, probably I'll get a... 60 is definitely wishful thinking. But as long as I can get a decent field going. 20? Let's just do 20. Wait, wait, yeah, what am I doing? There's already the traps... There's the traps that I already have. This is just a giant waste of time. Whatever. That's fine. I can always make more later. Oh, wait, yeah, I... That's right, okay, we'll just put it in the same spot. I'm still annoyed that Beggar broke both my f fire pits that I set up here. F dumbass. Oh well. More spam crafting! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. And I'll, I'll place, I'll replace all the old ones as well.
Wasn't a deer clops that broke it, not beg? Oh, probably. I think it wasn't. Actually... I can't remember. Because I remember fighting Beggar in this area as well. It, it might have been D-Clops. It probably was. Ugh, one of the two. The truth is... Well, you know, someone broke it at the end of the day, but... That's... Oh, wait. Are they actually... No, I messed up the placement of those. God damn it. That's right. Wait, did I? I think I did. I, yeah, I did, I did. They were too far away. Oh well. Alright, at least we've got a, at least we've got a proper field uh now. So that's good. Sweet. Now let's move some of these. I'm not going to put all of them down because there's a lot of traps here. Ah, shit. Yeah, I know I'm using my umbrella. Look. I... I just forget to do things like that. There's no excuse. I'm just a dumbass, but... <laughs> I'm doing Fredo's stream. Shh. It's okay. It's my fault. Yeah, and then I complain about not, not, having, not having enough silk to make more sewing kits, even though I've just worn it for no reason half the time. Pretty much. This is very tedious, but it's got to be done. Okay, I'll do one more row. That's freaking good enough for me, to be honest. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I know some of these are on like 10%. That's okay. There's a bunch of extra ones in that pile. I can just replace them when they get busted. Whoops. Uh, there we go. Alright, I'm done. Oh, I got one too many. Frick. Alright. Let's go and test that thing. <laughs> Imagine if I actually let it break. Look, if I did that, and I wouldn't put it past me, it's okay, because I've got um tons of... What's it called? I got like four more eyes or whatever, three more eyes. So, you know. All right, let's go. Let's test this thing and then get out of here. I am sleepy. It's pretty well. Technically, oh, I got to sort out this world. That was a test world. Let's get rid of this one. Let's regen it with the word. Okay. I'm just gonna put on mm, big boy health bar, and that's about that's it, I think. Yeah. Conservation of resources. Pfft. Come on, dude. This game takes so long to load. I swear. So, Klaus, um, Warrior Man's, honestly, I think they're going to be panicking and frozen a lot. Well, no, that's best case. Worst case is they kill the deer and then it's, um, uh, enraged Klaus. So. Do I not use global pause while I do something I can pause for? Yes, I have global pause enabled on my, um, main world that I play, unless I forget to turn it on. But this is a temporary one. I'm just doing one... I'm just testing one thing here, so... It doesn't really matter, but... 
I just want a health bar on so I can see how quickly he gets stomped. Uh, unless it doesn't work out, but, you know. Okay. Okay, let's just... Oh yeah, I've got to give myself a bunch of carrots as well. Uh, let's go. Let's make a bunch of warrior merm houses. Also clay. Skins for worts. Oh, that's right. I need marsh to... <sighs> it's going to take ages. No, let's just go to the swamp, actually. No. Well. Yeah. Let's just see if you go to the swamp. This is way easier than doing it over there. Okay. I don't care if the placement's messy. Also, I wonder what how did Wilson lose his eye in the um, survivor skin? <laughs> I mean, are the skins canon? I guess to a degree they are. It's a good question. Keyboard ASMR, real content. Hell yes. I've. I don't know, I, I, I know I need to upgrade my microphone, but it's hard to tell people are being ironic or not if they're talking about ASMR, but you know. Apparently some people do actually like the keyboard sounds, so I don't know. Uh, wait, yeah, how many am I actually going to go for? One, two, three, four... That's 12. Let's do 20. Because that's how many, about how many I have in my other world. 15, 16. Give or take. That sound is so weird. <laughs> Alright. Now we need to actually get a king. No, wrong thing. You. So. Bull kelp plant leaves, I guess? What? Uh, I remember this the prefab of this thing being weird. Bull kelp plant. No, that's ugh, for fuck's sake. <sighs> Whatever. Just do the job. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing content. <laughs> this is the dumbest way of spawning this in. I don't know what the prefab is, man. So right, if it works, it works. Bit of a bodge, but whatever. Yeah, this mod's out of date, so it doesn't have all the new, like, a new rain stuff. Well, it has a new rain, but not Return of Them, which is annoying. I know, I know I need to get a better mod like this, but... It's alright. That's a lot of spears. Yeah, 40 spears. Alright. Just feed up this loser. Oh. <laughs> the sound of all the doors opening. Okay, there's enough. Now I'm gonna befriend these l losers. Should I give them a helmet? No. No. Can't be bothered. So if I have a mohawk, if it's like on their witch's hump. Oh. Uh, this is the problem with the swamp. There's meanies everywhere. Okay, let's just get rid of this stupid spider den. Go 
Go away. Stop bothering me. Okay, keep befriending these guys. I think it's the mini swamp. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Which should mean there's a second pig village. So, it's cool. Not that it matters. Really. I'm going to be so mad this is like a really good world. Even though it's just a test world that I made. It happens all the time. Alright. We've got a lot of dudes. Let's do Clawsy Boy. Turn that off. We'll make myself invincible. I'm not going to bother like gearing, gearing myself up. Let's use a spear even. How about? This is just a test. Alright. The second one, oh, I will actually want a walking cane. Because walking canes are amazing. Alright. They shouldn't, honestly, I, I don't think they should attack. Oh, wait, yeah, I forgot that's how the deal work. They attack everything. I mean, look at that fucking damage they did. Holy crap. Ice time. Nope, fire again. Okay. Okay, so when they're all panicking, they do nothing. But one of the deer just oh, that's attacking me. That's right. Now I'll time for freezing. Hmm, I, I don't think this will work. <laughs> I mean, actually, maybe it will, because now they're all unfrozen. Okay, let's not attack them too much myself. I want to get the merms to do it all. Actually, you know what? They're not attacking the deer, so it's super chaotic. There's fire everywhere. But it's... I mean, they're doing good damage when they actually attack him. He does his ice attack afterwards. No. I know why he's doing fire twice in a row. It's really interesting. Okay, now time for Krampus. Three times in a row. Okay. Interesting. Four times in a row. Okay. I thought he was meant to alternate between the attacks, not just do one. Maybe I'm gonna attack him. Okay, there we go. That's good. That'll put out their fires. Some of them. Okay, when they attack him, they do hella damage. Of course, that's just... How... No, you're gonna attack him, you dip... You dummies. Also, if I accidentally hit a deer once, it's all over, so just gotta keep that in mind. Oh yeah, because when they all unfreeze, they lose aggro and shit, don't they? Whoops. <laughs> it might work. It's super chaotic, though. Actually, a lot of them are dying. Mostly because of the freeze and burn damage. Or, no, mostly just the fire, yeah. That's chaos. Normally when I spawn in bosses, I do it in the desert for no chaos. Ah, uh, true. Always this year. Oh, they're all frozen. They don't target frozen merms, which is interesting. Also, a whole bunch of merms are dead. Oh, their friendship time is running out. I only gave them carrots. Yeah, I'm just leaving. Okay. Yeah, well that's not helpful. I think it can work. Because there's also- I, I haven't been attacking him properly the whole time. Although Merms will block my kiting. Yeah, I think it might. I'll have to feed them more food though. That's the thing. Because they 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 weren't aggro onto him for very long. And also they do get wrecked up, like messed up by the fire. I just attacked a deer accidentally, so uh Okay. I'm done. They've had enough, yeah. Metric soups. Okay, well we've established that it can work. Yeah, the fire fucks them up. The ice, like, uh, removes all their aggro. That it can work. I need to give them more food than carrots, though. Because otherwise they lose interest. And also, they do die. Football helmets wouldn't help at all. Because it's freeze and heat they die to. Something better than carrot. Honestly, yeah. When they attack him, they do good damage. Honestly, they are best against Bee Queen, though, because they don't get affected by her, like, crowd control attack, which is a scream. They just don't care. 
which means I get in so much extra damage because she sits she sits f still for like five seconds when that happens, which is great. Wait, I just quit DST. I didn't mean to do that because now there's no visual on the um stream. <laughs> that was dumb. I just like did that by reflex. Whoops. All right, thanks for the stream, guys. It was good. Who are we going to raid? That's the real question. Let's do Mentos. Or Rovius, maybe? I don't know. And Rage Klaus is the hardest boss in... Oh, yeah. He is, isn't he? He has, he has more health than... um. Actually, I don't know how much health he has. It's a lot. That's for sure. Oh, actually, no, no. Mentos is not streaming. Let's do... Let's do long shot again. Twenty-seven. Oh, okay. It's just pretty. It's just that he has um so much. Like, damage. I think and jump. Thanks again. No problem. I'm here every day. It's what I do. Thank you for hanging out. It was good. Be back tomorrow with Uncomp, Wormwood. This is, that's going to be hell. <laughs> it's going to be hellish. Bye-bye. Raid time.